Mike Sports Vibes. Thank you for vibing with me. Man, you already know the vibes, man. Let's get it, man. Playoffs, baby. It's the playoffs. Can the Philadelphia 76ers beat the Knicks? Stephen A. Smith was saying they're going to win in five games. We're going to see. We're going to definitely see about that. Let's go, Sixers, man. Hit that like button. Hit that subscribe button. It's about to go down. About to put the scoreboard up right now. Let's go, Sixers, baby. Let's go. Let's go, man. About to be go time. I'm simply excited, man. This is, this is, whew, long time, long time waiting, man. Long time waiting. The wait is almost over. A couple more minutes and the game will start. Man, get y'all popcorn ready. Get your lemon pepper wings ready. It's about to go down. Yes, go Sixers, man. Let's go, man. Wow, 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 wow. Man, sound check, sound check. Let's go, man. Oh, it's about to be lit, man. It's about to be lit. Sound check, sound check. All right, sound check is good. Yeah, yeah, yeah. It's definitely going down, man. Mike Sports Vibes, thank you for vibing with me. Man, I just want to see good basketball, man. I just want to see good basketball, man. If we play 76 or basketball like we can play, I don't see anybody beating us. Let me say that again. If we play 76 or basketball like we can play, I don't see anybody beating us. You know what I mean? That's just how I feel, man. Talk that talk. People, people want to sleep on us. People want to hate. They want to say, oh, Joel and B's hurt. He ain't going to be to do anything. Yeah. Okay. We're going to see. I can't wait. I want to know. I want to see the energy. Tomorrow morning, first take. I want to see the energy of Stephen A. Smith. Let's go, Sixers Daniels in the building. Let's go. Yeah. Yeah, we just getting warmed up. We just getting started, man. Like, I can't, I'm looking forward to this game. I think it's going to be a good fight, this whole series. I think it's going to go back and forth. But we got to take care of game one, man. We got to apply that pressure to him in game one. And by applying pressure to them in game one, that, mean by, that means winning the first game of this series. That's what that means. That's what that means. Winning the first game of the series. You know what I mean? So let's go get this dub. Let's go win the game. And, and, and we're going to take possession by possession. And we, we got to make sure we rebound that dang on ball. We got to rebound that dang on ball. That's the number one thing for me. You know what I mean? That's the X factor for me. And no turnovers. No, not that many turnovers. Rebounding and take care of the, the basketball. Rebounding and take care of the basketball is the key for the Philadelphia 76ers to win. Because I don't feel like they're going to stop us like the uh, Miami Heat did. That zone that the Miami Heat had was, 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 was crazy. The Knicks can't do that. Hartenstein has no chance against Joel Embiid, the reigning MVP. Yes, he's not 100%. Yes. People are doubting us, but I just love it. They waking up a sleeping giant. They're waking up a sleeping giant. They think we small. We, they think that we are uh, uh, we the small dog, but we really the big dog in the building. We really the big dog in the in, in the building. What's up, bro? It's on. You already know. But you man. Yo, Ingram. What's up, man? What's up with my guy, man? Yeah, man. They was talking. Stephen A. Smith be talking so much stuff, man. But I love it though. I love it. I absolutely love it. Because at the end of the day, they about to be on this court in a few minutes. And look, the Timberwolves is beating the brakes off of the Suns. I pretty much called that game. You know what I mean? I said the Towns comes back and he's Towns. Bro, the Suns, that's why I be trying to tell people, you don't need three superstars to contend to compete for a championship. You don't need that, bro. You need maybe two stars and a bunch of role players that are solid and you got a chance. And if your chemistry is that good, and if you have a good head coach, you could win a championship. I am tired of these super teams. I hope the Suns get obliterated in the playoffs because I'm tired of seeing these super teams. I want them to lose. I like Devin Booker. I like KD. I like Bradley Bill. But, bro, like, come on, man. Where's the competition at, man? Where's the competition at? And Durant's going to request a trade. I can see it now, bro. Durant's going to request a trade. You already know. You already know. Devin Booker might request a dang on trade. You know what I mean? But 
I just, I just, we don't need, like, I like Paul George. There's rumors that the Sixers might go after Paul George after, the, after we win the championship this year. There's rumors we might do that. Phoenix going to bounce back. and now They're going to bounce back, but they ain't going to win the series. I, I, I know that. I know they're not going to win the series. Their team is not built like the, the, like the Timberwolves. The Timberwolves is, they got stars. They got superstars. They got a squad, bro. They got good role players. Like, bro, they are not as deep as the, as the Timberwolves. If the Timberwolves play their type of game, bro, the Suns might get it. They might get. They might go to a game six. I don't think it's gonna go to a game seven. I don't think so, bro. I just have a feeling that they're gonna choke. <laughs> they're gonna choke, bro. <laughs> I just hope they lose. I'm gonna keep it real. I just can't stand like how the NBA. Like I think. You know what I think it what started it really. It was the Celtics with KG and, and and Ray Allen and them. But I think really started the big three type conversation was. When LeBron went to the Heat with D Wade and Chris Bosch, and I'm tired of it, man. And then Kevin Durant went with the Warriors with Steph Curry and Klay Thompson and Green. I, I'm just tired of it, bro. Like we need some competition in the NBA. I want every team to be a contender or, or have a chance. Wouldn't that be cool? Every team has a superstar. Like it's a mandatory. Every team, well, can't be mandatory because you got to draft right. But it'd be so much better. The NBA, the product of the NBA, NBA would be so much better if every team had a chance to do something. You got teams that can barely win 10 games in a dang on season. Detroit Pistons. You know what I mean? We can't be having that, bro. Especially a franchise like Dumb. The Pistons got a really, really good history. You know what I mean? So how y'all going to let them go, go down like that? But it is what it is, man. Sixers, man. We're going to get this series in, I said five or six, but I'm, I'm leaning towards six more than five. But we have to take game one. This is a must. I ain't going to say it's a must win. But we got to really take game one, though. If it's going to go five, we got to take game one. Game six, if we don't, if we lose this game, we're going to win it in six. But shout out to you, Ingram. Shout out to everybody that's in the building. Appreciate it. If you haven't already, hit the like button. Hit the like button. Consider subscribing to your bull. Play by play for most of the Philadelphia 76 games this season. It's definitely going down, man. We about to get we about to get real lit, man. We about to get real lit out over here, man. It's about to go down for real, for real. And anybody that doubted the Sixers, keep doubting us, bro. You know what I mean? Keep doubting us. You know what I mean? Like I said, we're gonna stand on business. We're gonna win this game. And, and, and can't nobody stop it. Can't ain't nobody gonna stop it. Come on, man. A shout out to everybody that's in the building, man. I appreciate each and every one of y'all. The game will be starting soon. You know, there's always a delay. It says six o'clock, but you know, it never really starts at six o'clock. You know, um, it's like a 10, 15 minute, especially since it's the playoffs. It might start a little bit later than that. But shout out to everybody rocking with your bull, man. It's definitely going down. Um, if you haven't heard already, the the uh the Timberwolves are beating the Suns badly. So it's definitely going down. Bounce back. About to crack open a nice coat. Yeah, enjoy. Yeah, Brent. Gotta go get me some Chinese. Oh, 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 oh hold on now. Ho hold on now. Chinese food? What, what you get from the Chinese place, bro? I get that chicken, chicken lo mein. I get the uh chicken fried rice. I get the uh what I got? what else I get? Um the shrimp roll, the uh, I'm gonna keep it honest. I'm gonna be honest with you. That's all I really get, though. I ain't gonna lie. That's all I really get from the Chinese place. Game will be starting soon, y'all. We know it's about to go down. It's about to go down. Shout out to everybody rocking with your boy. Um, I I get the shrimp egg, yo. That's what my wife be getting, bro. <laughs> that's what my wife be getting, bro. Yeah, she be getting that. It's all right. I'm not like the, like, it's all right for me. Like, I ain't going to say it's nasty. It's all right. It's different. I had it the other day. I said, oh, this is different. I mean, got a little sauce you dip it in and all that. Shrimp lo mein, shrimp fried rice. Oh, yeah, shrimp fried rice, shrimp lo mein, yeah. And I'm going to say this right now. When you get Chinese food, you never, you always get your Chinese food from the hood. You never go somewhere, like, you got to make sure you get it from the hood. Like, it tastes the best. I mean, you don't want to get it from somewhere else because they don't they don't season their food right when you get it from somewhere else. You know what I mean? 
So you always make sure you get your Chinese food from the hood, man. It's the best. I try to get it from some place, and I, I said, this don't even got no dang on flavor. You know what I'm saying? Like, you know what I mean? <laughs> yeah. It didn't have no flavor last time I got. I should have got some Chinese food before this dang on game, bro. I'm about to be lit. I'm not even going. I'm not having no halftime break or nothing. I'm going all the way through, bro. It's about to go down. Shout out to everybody rocking with your boy. Game is about to start soon. We still want a commercial. Hopefully, they we start this game after this commercial break. But I don't know, man. Call in. My boy Evans in the building. Shout out to my boy Evan in the building. He's saying that the Sixers are going to beat the Knicks, man. That's my boy Evan right there. Shout out to my guy. Shout out to my guy. But yeah, man, I'm going to say this right now. I have a feeling Joel Embiid going to have a 40-piece nugget. I have a feeling Tyrese Maxey is going to have 30 points. I have a feeling... Tobias Harris is going to ball out this game. I know people are going to probably laugh at me like, nah, bro. They're laughing. They're laughing. Nah, bro. Nah. I, mean, nah. I honestly feel like Tobias is going to have a good game this game. Like, I just have a feeling. When you least suspect it, bro, this is when he's going to have, he's going to show up this game. Kelly Oubre, he's going to do his thing as well. Uh, he said, he said, debate his opinion. Nah, man. Yeah, man. But real talk, though, we're going to win this game. We're going to win this game. Oh, any boxing fans on the live? Who you got? Ryan Garcia? T.Y., I need to ask you a question. Ryan Garcia or uh, an Ingram or any boxing fans on the live? Ryan Garcia or Devin Haney? Let me know in the comments below before the game starts. Ryan Garcia or Devin Haney? For all the boxing fans, I'm going Devin Haney, but I like Ryan Garcia as well. I like, see, I fouled Devin like, before he was, like, really up there, like, famous and all that. You know what I mean? So I watched his journey. But, you know, it's going to definitely go down. Yo, Two Evils in the building. Shout out to my boy, Two Evil. He said, go Knicks. Nah, bruh. Nah, bruh. Nah. It's all about the Sixers over here, bruh. It's all about the Sixers over here, bruh. Let's go. Let's go. Let's go. Let's go. Devin, you got Devin. I got Devin Haney. My boy said, Devin Haney. Yeah, Ingram, I think Devin Haney going to win this, bro. I hope I hope it's a good fight. I hope there's no knockout. I hope it goes all the way. But Ryan Garcia can't be too aggressive um, or he might get knocked out. Just keeping it real. Uh, Ryan Garcia didn't even make the weight. He not taking this. Oh, uh, I don't I, I don't know, bro. I, I have no clue, bro. Like, how much did he not make the weight by, though? That, that's, a, that's, a, that's, that's crazy, though. How does that, Ingram, can you, can you explain? Because I'm not sure, like, what happens? Like, does he get penalized? Do they still fight today? Like, what happens if you don't make the weight? Gold Timberwolves. Yes, yeah, Sarah, 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 Sarah. The Timberwolves beat the brakes off of them. And I be trying to tell people. I try to tell people that, like, I don't think the Suns are that good, bro. They got three stars, and that's it. They got three superstars, well, two superstars, and that's it. The Timberwolves are built different. Like, they got a superstar in Ant. They got a star in Anthony Towns, and they got a whole bunch of good role players, bro, that are, like, really good. So I got the Timberwolves beating them in six six games. That's just my opinion. He came in three pounds overweight. Three pounds overweight? What? So what happens? If you're – if that happens, what happens? Like, do they get penalized? Like, does he – do they push the fight back until he makes weight, or is it up to the other the opponent to say, "Yo, we still gonna fight"? It is what it is. Like, how does that work, Ryan? Uh, we yeah, y'all y'all yeah y'all got a good solid team. The Timberwolves have a good solid team. That's why I'm trying to tell you, if I was from if I was from Minnesota, I would have definitely been a Timberwolves fan because of Kevin Garnett, just hands down. But the Timberwolves look they look good, man. And since Towns is back from the meniscus tear in his knee, bro, they got a chance. If I was a Minnesota fan, like a fan of all the teams, like Vikings and all that, I will I be found the Timberwolves right now. They're they got something special. They might actually get out the West. They might get out the West. That's how good they are. I could see them. I could see the Nuggets, and I could see the I don't know about the Thunder. They're just so young, but they're so good. I got either the Nuggets or the or, or the Timberwolves coming out the West. That's just my opinion. I might be wrong, but that's how I feel. Um, Ryan. 
Yeah, I, I don't know though, T. Why? I, I see. I I like him because I I I like Ryan Garcia. I like his confidence. He's a little bit um. I don't want to say arrogant. I just think he's really confident in his ability. But I just feel like he, I just feel like he just be doing too much on social media. Like he just be doing too much. Like, dude, just you gotta fight, bro. You gotta fight. You gotta show what's up. Like. You can't be doing all the extra stuff. Just train. That's why the promotion was, was so bad because it's like Ryan Garcia is doing all the promotion. Devin Haney is just training. That guy is just training in the gym the whole time. Um, New Timberland era, the new... Yeah, facts. 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 We about to get our guy in a couple of days too, Sarah. We about to get our guy. I don't know if we're going to trade up or what, but we're going to see what happens, man. I'm looking forward to it. All right, the game is finally about to start, y'all. The Knicks and the 76ers are about to start. Um, you don't like oh, you don't like Ryan Garcia. I like him, but I like Devin way more. I like Devin way more. I want to see Devin fate fight Tank after this. If he wins, I said if I think he's gonna win. I do think Devin's gonna beat him and knock him out, actually. But if he wins, I want to see him fight Shakur Stevenson or Tank Davis. That's just my dream. Thank you, Sarah. Good luck. Good luck with your Timberwolves. Let's go, baby. The Sixers are about to go. Let's go. All right, y'all. Get y'all popcorn ready. Mike Sports Vibes. Thank you for vibing All right, with let's me. Let's go. Let's go. All right. All right. Joel and B's about to. Whew, I'm nervous. I ain't gonna lie. I'm a little nervous because I, I mean it's not really nervous. It's just like I'm so excited and I just I just I, I don't know why they're taking so long to start this dang on game, bro. It's supposed to start at six o'clock. Wait, what, what time is it? It's 625, bro. <laughs> like 30 minutes late, bro. <laughs> like what? They should have just said 6.30. That's what they should have said. All right, let's go. They're about to jump the ball up. Let's go. Let's go. Yeah, jump ball. Jump ball. Come on. All right, finally. And the Knicks win the jump ball. All right, let me put the scoreboard up. Let's go, y'all. We about to get it popping. All right. Jalen Brunson gives it to Hardenstein. Hardenstein gives it to Josh Hart. Josh Hart passes to Jalen Brunson. Jalen Brunson's being guarded by Tobias Harris. Jalen Brunson with the ball, trying to drive past him. He stops his dribble, and he shoots up midi midi, misses it. Rebound by Dante Dante with the ball. He gives it to a wide open Josh Hart for a three, and he makes it. Nah, bruh. I don't like that. That's not a, I don't like that at all. We got to make sure we get our offensive rebounds. I mean, our defensive rebounds. All right, so 3-0 early, round one, game one. Let's go, baby. Timberwolves with the ball. All right, Tobias Harris with the ball. What you going to do with it, bro? He's dribbling the ball, looking, he's observing the court, gets it to Tyrese Maxey. Tyrese Maxey being guarded by OG Anobi, gets a screen by Joel Embiid. He shoots the three, and he misses it. Rebound by Josh Hart. Josh Hart with the ball, driving on Tobias here. He's taking it to him, going to the, oh, he passes to Hartenstein. Hartenstein stops the dribble, gives it to Dante Vinicenzo, and he passes to Hartenstein for a little hook shot, and he misses the hook shot. Rebound by Tobias Harris. Let's go, Sixers, baby. Let's go. Tobias Harris with the ball. Oh, he gives it to Joel Embiid. Joel Embiid shoots the three. And he makes it! MVP! Put the threes in the chat, everybody. Put the threes in the chat. Let's go. Josh Hart with the ball. He gives it to Hartenstein. Hartenstein's looking around. He gives it to Jalen Brunson. Jalen Brunson passes it to Josh Hart. Josh Hart's looking around. What you going to do with it? What you gonna, He gives it to... Dante, Dante does a little flutter over Joel Embiid. He misses. Oh, he misses it. Rebound by Joel Embiid. Joel Embiid with the ball. Point center. He's driving. Oh, what's he going to do with it? He has hard to time guarding him. He stops his dribble. He gives it to Kelly Oubre Jr. Kelly Oubre Jr. gives it to Kyle Lowry, but it gets hit out of bounds by Dante DiVincenzo, and it's still going to remain Sixer basketball. Let's go. Let's go, Sixers, bro. It's three to three, 10 minutes and six seconds left in the first quarter. Kyle Lowry gives it to Joel B. Joel B goes for the left. And one off the backboard. Layup. Let's go, Joel. MVP. 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 Let's go. Finish the three point play, baby. The reverse. I don't know what kind of layup that was, but he made it. All right, he made the free throw. It is six to zero. Jalen Brunson with the ball. Ten minutes left in the first quarter. Jalen Brunson, what you gonna do? Bounce pass to Hartenstein. Hartenstein gets it to Josh Hart. Josh Hart driving on Kyler. Easy layup. Oh no, he, he pucks the ball from his hand, but it goes out of bounds. 
and it will remain Nick's ball. Good defense by Kyle Lowry on that defense to recover and knock the ball out of his hand, but it went out of bounds, and it's going to be Nick's ball still. Jalen Brunson is going to inbound the ball. He gives it to Hardstar. Hardstar gives it right back to Jalen Brunson. Jalen Brunson looking around. All right, he's observing the court. Looks like he's going to get a screen by Dante DiVincenzo. He's being guarded by Tyrese Maxey. Oh, he's trying to cross him out. He's driving. He shoots a little midi, midi, midi. Makes it look easy. He makes it. Oh, man. That bull nice. Six to five. Six to five. Nine minutes and 35 seconds left in the first quarter. Kyle Lowry fakes the three. And then he gives it to Joel Embiid. The reigning MVP. He gives it to Tyrese Maxey. Gets a screen by Joel Embiid. He's driving on Hartenstein. Driving to the lane. Yeah, he turns. Oh, he doesn't turn the ball. He keeps. Remains his dribble. He's looking for Joel Embiid. Joel Embiid gets the ball in the post on OG and Obi. He's taking it to him. Going hard in the paint. And he makes it. And one, baby. Let's go, Sixers. Let's go. You can't stop him, Hartenstein. You can't stop him, OG and Obi. This is the reigning MVP. Let's go. A, a chance with another three-point play. You can't stop him. You have to foul him. Let's go. Man. Let's freaking go, baby. Like sports vibes. Thank you for you already know those vibes, with man. Me. We we about man, it's about to get lit, man. It's about to get lit. Jalen Brunson with the ball. All right, he gives it up to Josh Hart. He gives it to Hartenstein. Nine points for Joel B early on. Let's go. Josh Hart with the ball being guarded by Kyle Lowry. Kyle Lowry looking around. Oh, he passes it to OJ Anobi. OJ Anobi, what you gonna do? He gives it to Josh Hart for a three, and Josh Hart misses the three, but they get the offensive rebound. Josh Jalen Brunson gives it to OJ Noah for three. He misses it as well. But rebound by Tobias Harris. Tobias Harris with the ball. What you going to do with it, bro? He's driving. He's driving. He's driving. He almost turns the ball over. And he gives it to Tyrese. Tyrese gives it to Kyle Lowry. He fakes a three. He's driving to the lane. Gives it to Joella B. Joella B might shoot the three over top of him. I don't know. He's at the top of the... Th oh, come on. He's driving on Dante. Oh, he passes to Tyrese Massey. Tyrese Massey driving to the lane. He gives it to a wide open. Tobias Harris for a wide open three. He backs in. Put the threes in the chat. Put the threes in the chip. Six was up 12 to 5. Jalen Brunson shoots the three. He misses it. Rebound by Tobias Harris. He passes it all. Oh, he turns the ball over. Dante Divincenzo steals the ball. Hartenstein gets the ball. He puts it up, but he gets fouled. Go to the free throw line for two. Let's go, Sixers. Let's go. We getting hype, man. Shout out to everybody rocking with your boy. You already know the vibes. And B went back to back mini fro. Let's go. Let's go. Shout out to everybody rocking with your boy. If you haven't already, hit that like button. Hit that like button. Hit that like button. Consider subscribing to your bull. I do play by play for most of the Philadelphia 76 games this season. It's definitely, definitely going down. You already know the vibes. Let's go. Man, stop playing with us, man. Stephen A. Smith, you said five games. We won't see about that. We shall see about that. We shall see about that. But um, Isaiah Hartenstein is at the free throw line. He just made one free throw. It's about to go down. Y'all shout out to everybody rocking with your bull. It's definitely, definitely. I keep saying it because it really is going down. The playoffs has officially started for the Philadelphia 76ers. Let's go. We in Philly right now. Let's go. Kyle Lowry gives it to Tyrese Maxey. Let's go, Tyrese. Let's go, Tyrese. Let's go. Let's go, Tyrese Maxey with the ball. He's driving. Oh, he's driving. He's driving. He's driving to the line. Oh, look at the easy layup. He just drove to the finger roll layup and got the bucket. 14 to 7, 8 minutes and 2 seconds left in the first quarter. Jalen Brunson being guarded by Kelly Oubre Jr. Let's go. Let's go. What you going to do? Oh, he falls on the ground. Kelly Oubre Jr. falls in bounce. Bounce pass. Oh, there's a foul. He ran into Joel Embiid. There will be a foul on Joel Embiid, on Josh Hart. Joel Embiid's first foul. Let's go. Let's go. Let's ball out. Let's go. Ain't about nothing. Ain't about nothing. Yeah, that should be a travel, T.Y. That should be a travel, bro. Like, I don't know what that was, bro. bro we ain't going to worry about nothing like that, bro. But as long as Joel Embiid don't get in foul trouble for that. But, yeah, man, let's get it, man. Put the threes in the chat when we hit a three, man. If y'all don't know, when I say put the threes in the chat, put the threes in the chat when we hit the threes. Let's go. Oh, Jalen Brunson shoots the midi, misses it. Rebound by Tobias. Tobias, I'm loving your rebounding, bro. I'm loving your rebounding early on. Let's go, Tyrese Maxey with the ball going between his legs. He gives it to Joel. Joel gives it right to Tyrese for a three. And he makes it, baby. Put the threes in the chat. Put the threes in the chat. 17 to 7. Seven minutes and 27 seconds left in the first quarter. Jalen Brunson with the ball being guarded by Kelly Oubre Jr. He's driving past Kelly. He passes it to Josh Hart. Josh Hart almost gets the ball stolen by that ball. Tobias Harris. He's balling right now. Tobias on the boards is dominating. I love it. We need every defensive rebound. Let's go. 
and he's playing good defense right now. Come on, Tobias. I'm cheering for you, my guy. Let's go. Hearts is down with the ball. He gives it to OG Anobi. OG Anobi, what you going to do? He shoots the midi over top of Tobias. Misses it terribly. But Josh Hart gets the offensive rebound. Dante different chisel with the three. He misses it too. Rebound by. Oh, it's still going to be Nick's ball. Goodness gracious. Another possession for the Knicks with 14. Man, that was good defense. Gosh, Lee, another 14 seconds for the Knicks. They're going to inbound the ball. OJ Nobi's going to inbound the ball. He gives it to Dante DiVincenzo. He passes it to Jalen. Oh, he passes it to Hartenstein. Hartenstein gives it to Jalen Brunson. Jalen Brunson with the ball. Being guarded by Kelly. Oh, he steals the ball. Kelly O'Brien steals the ball on the fast break. Puts up the layup. Misses it. But, uh, oh, he gets, but he gets fouled, y'all. Let's go. <laughs> Yo, let's freaking go, PP. Oh, my. Yeah. Yeah, yeah, I'm talking trash. Yeah, now what? Now what, Knicks fans? Now what? Let's freaking go, baby. Let's go, baby. Let's go. Yeah, I, I, I you know, you know what's crazy? I said he's gonna do something this game too. When you least expect him to do it, he's gonna do it. I knew he was gonna do something. He's doing really good with the rebounding. I need him to keep it up. We need everybody hands on deck, rebounding, rebounding. Rebounding and rebounding. Box out. Rebound. Don't look at the ball to drop to your hands. You go box out and you go get that ball. No more looking for the ball to come fall to your hands. When you get them defensive rebounds, you box out and somebody gets that rebound. That's what we need to do all game. That's how you control the game. Rebounding controls the game of basketball on the defensive side of the ball. I'm talking mainly the defensive rebounds more than the offensive rebounds. But if you could get them offensive rebounds as well as those defensive rebounds, that's called that's how you dominate the game. Because that means you have the other team has less possessions to score. And then you have more possessions to score if you get the offensive rebounds. Can I talk that talk, man? Talk that talk. You already know the vibes. I had to flag backwards. I don't like that. But let's go, baby. Let's freaking go. The Knicks call early timeout. We're on a commercial break right now. Yeah, Stephen A. Smith was talking crazy, bro. Was talking crazy. My boy Evan said Sixers for life. That's what's up, bro. Shout out to everybody rocking with your boy. You already know the vibes, man. We doing big things. We doing big things over here, man. Big things popping, little things stopping. If you haven't already, hit that like button. Hit that like button. Hit that like button, man. But consider subscribing to your boy, man. You know the vibes. We going live mostly every game. Um, There is one game on the NFL draft. I won't be live for that game, y'all. I will be going live for my... My my football team, my Vikings. If you don't know, if, if you don't know by now, I'm Philly everything besides football. Football, I'm a Viking fan. So for that particular game, I will be I will be keeping track of the game, but I won't be doing the play by play for that particular game. But mostly every other game, I should be live. It's definitely going down. Let's go Sixers, man. We doing a big we doing big things right now. We doing big things. You know what I mean? Shout out to everybody rocking with your boy. We just getting started, Mike Coach, Mike. Yeah, man. Yeah, hey, bro. I'm just keeping it real. I'm keeping it, bro. I'm talk keeping it real, bro. That like talk. You have to rebound the ball, <laughs> like, like that's the key, bro. <laughs> that's the key to winning the series. You have to out rebound the ball. <laughs> I mean, out rebound the other team. But shout out to everybody rocking with your boy. You already know the vibes, man. Shout out to Ty. Shout out to my boy Evan. Shout out to Scolding. Scolding, what's up? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Them T Wolves is beating the brakes off of them bulls. Scolding. Yeah, yeah. All them all them three superstars. You don't need three superstars to be contenders in the NBA. That's you don't need all that. You know what I mean? You just need maybe a star or two, maybe superstar and a star and a whole bunch of good role players that play like stars sometimes. Let's go, man. Let me talk that talk. I'm tired of it, man. I'm tired of the 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 the, the big three. Like I'm tired of that. We don't need that. The 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 uh Timberwolves have a star in towns and they have a superstar in ant. And then another good example is um, the Nuggets, Jokic and Murray. Jokic is a superstar. Murray is a star. You don't need to have three superstars to win a championship. That means the rest of your team is probably going to be garbage. I hope I hope the team will sweep them, to be honest with you. I don't think that's going to happen because they got a lot of talent, KD and Devin Booker and Bradley Bill, but I don't even care about none of that, bro. Let's get back to the Sixers, man. Brunson, Jalen Brunson is a very good player, but he is not going to have a good series this, 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 against the Sixers. He's not. It's not happening. Kelly Uber Jr. shoots the first free throw and he makes it. It is 18 to 7. It is 18 to 7 with six minutes and 55 seconds left in the first quarter. Yeah, what do you think the final score will be 
Oh, 125 to 115. 125 to 115. Let's go. Let's go. Let's go. Dr. Vincenzo passes the Hartenstein. Hartenstein to Stein. Hart to Stein gives it to Jalen Brunson. Being guarded by Tyrese Maxey. He's driving past Tyrese Maxey. He puts up a, a midi, misses it, but he gets his own rebound. Come on, y'all. Puts up a shot, misses it again. Get the rebound. Get the freaking, oh my gosh. Hart to Stein gets an offensive rebound, and then he dunks it. Come on, y'all. We have to get our rebounds, bro. We have to get our rebounds. Come on. Let's go. Come on. Let's go. They got five offensive rebounds already. Let's go. Tyrese Maxey with the ball. Shoots the three. There would be a defensive foul on... Oh, he fouled. He fouled Joel Embiid. He ran into him. Yeah, we got to stop letting them get these dang... Oh, he smacked them in the face with that. Gosh, look. But, uh, yeah, we got to get our defensive rebounds, y'all. We got to get our defensive rebounds. My end, 33-9 and 10. Yeah, he a monster, man. He a superstar for real. He only like 22, 21 years old, too. That's the craziest thing about it. Like, he's still young. He's still... He probably ain't even stopped growing as a man. Like, he's still getting... That ball, nice. I ain't going to lie. Let's go. Joel Embiid with the ball. Gives it to Kelly Oubre Jr. Gets a screen by Joel Embiid. He starts to dribble. Gives it to Joel Embiid. Joel Embiid looking around him. He's going between the lanes. About to cross up. Hartenstein step back midi. He gives it to Kyle Lowry. Kyle Lowry driving. Shoots the midi wide open. And he misses it. Uh, Joel Embiid smacks it out. Gives it, it goes right to Kyle Lowry. Kyle Lowry misses it. Oh, dang. Let's go. Rebound by the Knicks. Josh Hart. He gives it to Hartenstein. Hartenstein does a bounce pass to Jalen Brunson for an easy layup off the backboard and one, and he will be going to the line for another one. It's a seven-point game, 18 to 11. Can potentially make it a six-point game if he gets this free throw. Come on, six. Let's go, baby. Let's go. Let's go. Get the rebounds. Yeah, yeah. We got to get them rebounds, man. We got to keep it at 1,000. We got to keep it We got to keep it all the way 1,000. Let's go, Sixers, man. Yeah, we're not playing no games, bro. We're not playing no games. We will win this game, bro. We will win this game. I don't care what nobody says. Put some respect on the Sixers' name. We're going to win this game. I don't care what nobody says, bro. You could doubt, you could doubt all you want. We're going to win this. We're going to win this game at the end of the day. Let's go, Tyrese Maxey. Ooh, that's not a fact. All right, let's go. Well, we're not in Philly. I, I thought I said we in Philly. We ain't in Philly. Let's go. Let's go. Oh, Tyrese Massey gives it to Joel. Joel, oh, he fakes the three. No, he shoots the three. Misses it. Rebound by Hartenstein. I'm not really a big fan of that shot, to be honest with you. Gives it to uh, Dante DiVincenzo. He shoots a three from outer space, and he makes it. Oh, my gosh. All right, it's 18 to 15. 18 to 15. Knicks are officially are back in business. It is 18 to 15 with five minutes and four seconds left in the first quarter. Tyrese Massey gives a screen by Joel Embiid. He gives it to Tobias Harris for three. Tobias Harris misses everything besides the backboard. Oh, my goodness. Jalen Brunson with the ball. What you going to do with it, bro? He's being guarded by Kyle Lowry. Come on, let's play that defense, baby. He's driving. Jalen Brunson driving to the lane. Oh, nope, nope. Good defense by Kyle Lowry. Oh, good tip. Oh, almost a turnover. Let's go. OG Anobi goes hard in the paint. He gets, ah, get the rebound. Oh, my gosh, bro. Oh, it doesn't count. It was interference of the ball, so it's not going to count that bucket. We got to get our rebounds, bro. We really got to get our rebounds. Good contest at the freaking um in the paint by Joel Embiid on OG and Nobi. That could have been an easy layup, but it's not going to count because Hartenstein hit the ball before because it could have went in, honestly. But um, that's basket interference, and it will be Sixer basketball. 18 to 15, four minutes and 42 seconds left in the first quarter. The Philadelphia 76ers are playing really good so far in this first quarter, and I need them to keep doing it. Let's go. Kyle Lowry gives it to Joel Embiid. Joel Embiid got hard to start on him. He's about to take him to school. He's about to shoot the midi over top. He does shoot the midi, and he makes it look easy. Shout out to Joel Embiid. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. 11 points in the first quarter. What's up? What did he say? What they say about him? What they say about him? Yeah. Okay. We're going to see. We're going to see. Let's go. Jalen Brunson with the ball. Being guarded by Tyrese Maxey. Gets a screen by Hartenstein. He shoots a three. Then he gets blocked from behind, I believe. He gets blocked from behind, I believe. Is that a bounds by Knicks? It's a turnover. Sixers ball. Let's go. Let's be playing that. We're playing that, that 76 or basketball right now, bro. Like, stop playing with me. He gets blocked from behind by uh, Tyrese Maxey on that shot by Jalen Brunson. Good 
recovery. He got screened by Hartenstein, but then he recovered and blocked Jalen Brunson when he shot the three. Let's freaking go. Tyrese Maxey. Joel B has heart to stand on him. It's one on one. Are you serious? You're going to, oh, double T comes. Tyrese Maxey for open three. Misses it. Get the rebound. Get the rebound by Joel B. Oh, man. It's going to be six or ball, but there's no foul. Joel B is looking for a foul. There's no foul. But uh, good hustle by Joel B on that offensive rebound. Good hustle by Joel B on that offensive rebound. It's going, it went out of bounds, but it's going to remain six or basketball. Shout out to everybody rocking with your bull. It is a full timeout by the Knicks. If you haven't already, hit that like button, hit that like button. Consider subscribing to your bull. I do play by play for most of the Philadelphia 76 games this season. It's definitely going down, man. Oh, by the way, Shake and Bake is on the Knicks. I did not know Shake and Bake was on the Knicks. Why did I feel like he was on another team? What did, did it, hold on? I don't know. Let me not even say anything. I don't even know. I don't even know. But Shake and Bake, if you don't know who that is, we call him Shake and Bake in Philly when he was on the Sixers. That's Shake Milton. But it is what it is, man. It is what it is. But, yeah, man, we playing really good, man. We're, we're up by five. Um, we're hustling. We're making the hustle plays. The Sixers are looking really good. Joel Embiid's looking excellent. He does not look injured at all. He's playing great on both sides of the court. That contested shot um, on OG Anobi in particular, he went to the – he was in the paint, went for the layup, and Joel Embiid put that hand up and said, nah, bruh, and he missed it. That was excellent. That's what we need. We need it on both sides, not just on the offensive side of the ball. I want to, I want to see the keep. I want that to continue, and also, I want to see somebody get hot from three on the Sixers. Somebody has to get hot from three on the Sixers. I'm not saying a performance like Nicholas Batum, but maybe it could be just a group. It doesn't have to just be one person. I would love to see Butterhill hit a couple of threes. I would love to see um, Tyrese Maxey hit a a couple of threes as well, of course. He's probably the best three-point shooter on the team, debatably. Um, who else? Kelly Oubre Jr., Tobias. I need someone to really, we need to make our threes. Because I'm going to tell you this right now. Joel Embiid is going to get double teamed. He's get, he, they're, they're not going to let him do, they're not going to let him just be one-on-one -on -one all like that. They they just threw a double team at him just now, right? When he was, uh, when Hartenstein was guarding him. So, when that happens and he gives it to you and you have the wide open three-point shot, you have to make it, bro. More times than not, we need every we need every point, obviously, but we need that, man. When you're wide open, we need you to make them shots, man. We really do. You know what I mean? Because that, cause it's, that's going to open it up for Joel Embiid as well because it, not, it's like pick your poison. Joel Embiid is going to cook you in the paint. He's going to cook you if you guard him one-on-one. You send the double team, he going, we're going to cook you with the three-point shots. So it's like, pick your poison. What do you want? You want us to cook you this way or you want us to cook you that way? You know what I mean? Let me talk that talk, man. Talk that talk. Yeah, you already know the vibes, man. Shout out to everybody rocking with your bull. You already know the vibes. We about to, we about to do our thing right now. We're doing our thing right now. Yo, I'm loving what I'm seeing, though, man, from the Sixers right now. I'm loving it. This is a hard environment to play in, and they're balling. They're balling, bro. We're balling. Sixers are balling. Tobias Harris got the uh, tablet in his hand. Tyrese Manson with five points, two assists, two of four from the field. I'm not sure if there's if Joel Embiid is sitting yet, but um, yeah, this is a good this is a good first half for the Sixers, man. How many more minutes we got in the first half? We got about three minutes and fifty three seconds left in the first quarter, and I'm loving what I'm seeing from the six. Oh, they're reviewing the play. So, all right. So, what? All right. Let me see. So, he grabbed the ball. Joel Embiid had the ball. Hold on. Can y'all slow it down? All right. Tyrese Manson shoots the three. It hit. It go bounces off the rim. Joel Embiid grabs the ball. He rips it from him. I don't know if that's is that sixer ball. No, it is Nick's ball. Okay, so it's going to be Nick's ball. Okay. What happened just now? By the way, round one, game one, Philadelphia 76ers versus the New York Knicks is going down, y'all. They stopped the, all right, so Dante DiVincenzo is going to inbound the ball. All right, let's get it. All right, Jalen Brunson with the ball. What you going to do with it? What you going to do with it? Oh, oh, what you going to do? Oh, he's driving, he's driving to the lane, driving to the lane. Oh, 
He passes it to Josh Hart for a corner three. Misses to get the rebound. Get the rebound. Oh, tell Reese Massey with the ball. Fast break, baby. Off the backboard. Gets it in time. Reese Maxi. Let's freaking go. Let's go. Mitchell Robinson's in for Hartenstein. And Bodanovich is in. Let's go. Dante DiVincenzo De gives it to Mitchell. He gives it back to Jalen Brunson. Jalen Brunson, he turns the ball over. Good defense by the Sixers. J Joel Embiid with the ball, point center. Let's go. Joel Embiid, he has Robinson. He, oh, he stops the dribble, gives it to a wide open Nicholas with two for three, baby. And he makes it, baby. Let's go, baby. Let's go. Let's go. Put the threes in the chat. Let's put the threes in the chat. Let's go. 7 0 run in the last one minute and 38 seconds less. Let's go. 10 point game, 25 to 15, two minutes and 44 seconds less. In the first quarter, Jalen Brunson being guarded by Kyle Lowry. He's driving. He puts up a shot. He gets fouled. Go through the free throw line for two. They're saying that Kyle Lowry pushed him a little bit on that shot. Kyle Lowry's trying to dispute it, but they're going to get that to him. He is a star. He is definitely that guy. So we're going to see. Shout out to everybody rocking with your boy. If you haven't already, put that, put that like, hit that like, hit that like button. But, man, I'm loving, I'm loving what Nicholas Platoon's been doing the especially last game, this game, he already shooting threes and making them. So I'm loving what I'm seeing, man. The Sixers are looking excellent, bro. I'm curious. Oh, Buddy Hill's in the game. Buddy Hill's in the game. I need you to do your thing for uh, Tyrese Maxey. Hold on, is Cameron Payne in the game? Oh, no, Kyle Lowry's still in the game. So Buddy Hill's in the game. Nicholas Batoon. They taking out Joel? I don't think they're taking out Joel yet. Six points for Jalen Brunson. Three rebounds for Jalen Brunson. Two of eight from the field. All right. 25 to 16, 25 to 17. Two minutes and 39 seconds left in the first quarter. He did make both his free throws. Kelly Oubre Jr. is still in the game. Let's go. Gives it to Kyle Lowry. Kyle Lowry gives it to Joel Embiid. Oh, he got Robinson. Cook him, baby. Cook him. Cook me for the double team. Comes. He's going hard in the paint. Shorty with your thing. And he gets it in. He cooks him once again. Joel Embiid. 27 to 17. Two minutes and 16. 13 points in the first quarter by Joel Embiid and two rebounds. Five or six from the field. Let's freaking go, baby. Jalen Brunson with the ball. Oh, snap. Wait, wait, is it a three-second violation? Tell me that's not a three-second violation. Please tell me that's not a three-second violation. Is it a technical foul? Tell me that's not a three. Come on, bro. Yo, Joel Embiid cooking everybody, bro. All that. Oh, he's he he's not the same. Uh, he's hey, yeah, he is hurt, but he's still better than half. He's better. He's still better than ninety nine point nine percent of the league still to this day. And he missed the free throw. Yeah, take that, Knicks. Take that, Knicks. Take that, Knicks. Yeah, and you missed the free throw, baby. Shout out to Ron's opinion. Don't matter. You are little vibes, man. Your opinion does matter. Yes, let's go sixes. Hit hit some threes. Let's go. He heal will. Uh, yeah, shot. Oh my gosh, easy layup by. Come on, bro. We're not going to do that, bro. All right, let's go. Knicks just got the easy layup. I believe that was Dante DiVincenzo. Yep, it was. Jalen Brunson with the assist. Let's go. Oh, Joel Embiid with the ball. Oh, going behind his back. Oh, he's trying to cook him. Oh, he gives it to Buddy Hill. Buddy Hill driving. He gives it to Kyle Lowry. Kyle Lowry shoots the three. Makes it, baby. Put the threes in the chat. Put the threes in the chat. 30 to 19, baby. One minute and 37 seconds left in the first quarter. Five of ten from three. Let's go, Sixers, baby. Dante DiVincenzo with the ball gives it to Robinson. Robinson bounce pass to Dante DiVincenzo. He misses the misses the layup. The altar shot by Joel B. Rebound by Kyle. There's only one way to smash your goal while smashing nacho cheese chips. Cheating! Woo! Cheat on chips. The dang old ad just popped up. My bad, y'all. Bounce pass to Kelly Uber Jr. He misses the bunny, but he got fouled going to the free throw line for two. That was so random but yeah i don't know why them advertisements be popping up out of nowhere but when we're playing really good man the ball movement like the assists and all that man we doing excellent bro shout out to everybody rocking with your ball man put the threes in the chat when you can when, when we hit them threes man kelly uber Jr. made the first free throw and it is 31 to 19 31 to 19 one minute and 14 seconds left in the first quarter Miles McBride is a very good three-point shooter. We have to make sure we guard the perimeter on this team. But like I said before, they have one star slash superstar, if you want to call Jalen Brunson a superstar, and everybody else is very good role players. 
Hartenstein can't stop Joel Embiid one on one. OG Anobi is a okay. He's a good all around player, but stop the cat with all the other stuff, man. Let's keep it going. Josh Hart with the ball. Let's go. Being guarded by Kyle Lowry, passes it to Robinson. Robinson looking for Jalen Brunson. He gets it to Jalen Brunson. Jalen Brunson being guarded by Nicholas Mattoon. He gets the screen by Robinson. He drives it to the lane, drives it to the lane, gives it to a wide open McBride for three, and he makes it. I said, a very good three point shooter. That's the one player that I'm like, all right, you have to put your hand up and make sure you guard him because he can shoot the three. You know what I mean? Let's go. Kyle Lowry with the ball. What, gets, gets a screen by Joel B. Bounce pass to Joel B. Joel B. Is driving, shoots a little midi, 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 misses it. Rebound by Bodanovich. Bodanovich with the rebound. 34 seconds left in the first quarter. Bodanovich driving on Kelly Oubre Jr. Puts up a shot, gets blocked, but there will be a foul. And he's going to the free throw line for two. Second foul on Joel Embiid. Get him out the game, please. I don't want no more fouls in 30 seconds on Joel Embiid. That's something I do not want. So take him out the game. How, where? All right, Joel Embiid, Joel Embiid, let's go. Oh, oh no, it was on Kyle Lowry, it looks like, I think, I believe. Hopefully that's what it is and not on Joel Embiid. All right, free throws, one more free throw for Bodanovich. 32 to 23. 20, 32 to 23. Shout out to everybody rocking with your bull. If you haven't already, hit that like button. Hit that like button. Consider subscribing to your bull. Play by play for most of the Philadelphia 76 games this season. It's definitely going down. Go Philly, man. Go Sixers. We doing it, man. We play 76 or basketball. We can beat anybody. Talk that talk. You already know the vibes. Let's go. Talk that talk. Let's go. Let's go. Tyrese Maxey with the ball. 26 seconds left in the first quarter. He's looking around, observing the court. He's going to wind that time down. Let's go, guys. McBride on him. He's about to, oh, he's driving on McBride. He's looking for Joel Embiid. Give it to Joel Embiid right now. Right now. Get it to him. He gives it to Joel Embiid. He has Robinson. He's brothers a spin move. Lay up on him. He misses. Gets his own board. Puts it back up. Gets fouled. He's going to the free throw line for two. Joel Embiid. He is dominating. He is dominating. MVP. 7.6 seconds left in. The first quarter, the Philadelphia 76ers are up 32 to 24 with a chance to make it a 10 point game. If Joel Embiid makes these free throws, let's go. MVP is at the free throw line. Let's go. Number 21. Let's go. Let's go. He shoots the first free throw and he makes it look easy. That's a nine point game for the Philadelphia 76ers. It is. It is 33 to 24. Let's keep it going. Let's keep it going. Let's keep it going. All right, he gets the ball. Let's make this next free throw, make it a 10-point game. I don't know how many points Joel Embiid got in this first quarter, but he got at least 15 or 13 points first quarter, bro. It's crazy. And he makes both of them. Is it a 10-point game, 34 to 24, with 7.6 seconds left in the first quarter? Jalen Brunson inbounds the ball. Oh, a steal! Oh, I thought it was a steal. It's a foul. Come on, bro. Come on, ref. Get out of here with that bogus call, bro. If you want to call that little ticky tag, you better call everything. You better call everything. You better call everything. For real, though. We're not going to do that. Ticky tag foul. Get out of here, bro. Come on, bro. Out of here with that. Good defense by uh, Tobias. And that's why he missed the first free throw. That's why he missed the first free throw. The ball don't lie. Stop playing with us. 7.2 seconds left in the first quarter. Sixers got a chance to get a three or a, or a two at the end. They got 7.2 seconds, so we just got to make sure we get an offensive rebound. If he misses, he shoots it, and he makes this one. So it's a nine-point game with a chance to make it a little bit more. Tyrese Maxey with the ball. Let's go. Six, five, four. Come on, drive, drive, drive. Two, three. Oh, a three by Joe Wallen. He puts it up. Oh, he misses at the buzzer, and the Philadelphia 76ers will be winning the first quarter by nine points. 34 to 25. The six are looking excellent. Hey. Yeah, yeah. You're probably like, it's only the first quarter, Mike. We got enough time. Yeah, y'all do have enough time. Just like we got enough time to cook y'all as well. Let's go, Sixers, baby. Playing excellent, man. 
We are absolutely playing excellent. Joel B played the whole first quarter, bro. He played the whole first quarter, bro. This is this is amazing what I'm seeing from Joel B. This is amazing what I'm seeing from the Philadelphia 76ers, man. We're going we gonna to put some respect on the Sixers' name, man. We're doing the dang on thing. We're doing the dang on thing. Stop playing with us. Stop hating and appreciate the greatness that you've seen on this basketball court. For real. Let me see how many points this man got in the first quarter, y'all. Y'all, y'all, man, people be thinking I'll be playing when I be saying this, man. I know he gets injured a lot, but he's still the best, bro. I'm trying to tell y'all. Let me see what this man is doing right now, man. People be thinking it's, thinking it's a game over here. I'm out. No, we stand on business, bro. This playoff run, we standing on business. We got the coach. We got the talent. We got that bull. Joel Embiid. You already know. We got that bull Tyrese Maxey. He got 15 points, bro, already. That's not even the, the full story or the first quarter, bro. He was altering shots. He had two assists. He had three rebounds in 12 minutes, bro. Like, come on, bro. Come on, bro. Yeah, that's that's our MVP, Sixer fans. That's our MVP. Let's go. I don't care what the league says about who wins MVP this year, but that's our MVP. Joel Embiid is. Tyrese Massey with seven um, points in the first quarter, two assists, one rebound. Tobias Harris with three points and four big rebounds. I was very impressed with uh, Tobias when it came to the rebounding. Nicholas Batum hit a three, just got in the game and hit a three. He's still hot from three. Kyle Lowry played good defense, had, and he also had three points, one assist, and two rebounds in the first quarter. The Philadelphia 76ers are definitely balling. You know what I mean? We're standing on business, man. They called us the small dog, but we really the big dog. You feel me? They call us the small dog, but we really the big dog. You get what I'm saying? Like, they don't want to give us the credit, man. They don't want to give us the love. But at the end of the day, we want to take, we want to take what we want. We want to take what we want. And we want to take this game. We want to take this game from y'all. Y'all y'all in New York, y'all think it's sweet over here. You think the Sixers are sweet or something. We're going to beat you in your home court, baby. Game one. Applying that pressure. Game one. Let's go. Shout out to the Philadelphia 76ers balling right now. They hustling. They hustling right now. Stop playing with me, man. MVP in the house. It's cooking time. You already know the old vibes, T.Y. T.Y., you know the old vibes. Stop Tell him to stop playing with us. Scolding. Shout out to my bull, Scolding, bro. He said, I ain't back, Mike. Teacher got game. Yes. Yes. Teacher got game, my guy. He's in the building, man. Shout out to Teacher got game. Appreciate you, my guy. I appreciate you, my guy. You've been rocking with me for a minute. Scolding, T.Y. Everybody that's been in the chat been rocking with me for a minute. Even the new people. Thank you for joining the uh, YouTube family, man. It's definitely going down. Uh, we're going to be doing lives for almost every game this playoff run. The only game that I don't think I'm going to be able to do to keep it real is I'm not going to be, I'm not going to do is, um, is I think it's the 25th. That's the NFL draft. I'm not going to do that game, but I will be definitely following it. You feel me? Like, that's the thing, bro. Like, I will definitely be following it. It ain't about nothing. I wish I could like pause this or something, but it won't pause. All right. I'm not sure if y'all hear that. Hopefully y'all don't hear that commercial. All right, let's go. Ball reason the game for to, uh, Joel B. Tyrese Massey shoots the three out of bounds on Josh Hart. And he's complaining. How is that on him? Yo, dog, you hit the ball last. That's how, bro. Like, what are you talking about, bro? Like, what are you talking about, Josh Hart? It went out on you, bro. That's why it's still sixer ball. Let's go. Stop playing. Tobias Harris, man, not, oh, Nicholas with two inbounds the ball to Tobias Harris. He misses the alley -oop. But Bodanovich with the ball, he shoots the three and he will brick. Oh, he makes it off the backboard. Ooh. All right, 34 to 28, 34 to 28. Bodanovich makes the three. 11 minutes and 24 seconds left in the second quarter. Tobias Harris with the ball. He gives it to Nicholas with two. Nicholas with two is being guarded by Bodanovich. Bodanovich is like, Reaching in like crazy, but he gets it to Tyrese. Tyrese Maxey gives it to a Buddy Hill. Buddy Hill swings it to Tobias here for corner three. He misses it. Rebound by Josh Hart. Josh Hart with the ball. Let's go. Play defense. Let's go. Gives it to McBride for a three. And McBride makes a three. Oh, my gosh. Back-to-back -back three. That's six points right there. 34-31 to 31 is a three-point game with 10 minutes and 55 seconds left in the second quarter. The Knicks are making a little run on us, but it is what it is. It's, going, it's, a, it's a game of runs. Let's keep it going. Let's go. Tyrese Massey going between his legs. He gives it to Tobias Harris. Tobias Harris looking around, trying to cook, 
Josh Hart, he's backing him down, backing him down. Come on, Chabaz. Show him what it is. He shoots up the midi, misses it. Rebound by Paul Reed in the mud, puts it back up. He didn't get it in, baby. Paul Reed, baby. Let's go. Let's go, Sixers, baby. Let's go, baby. Brad tried to cross up Buddy Hill. He's going between the legs. He passes to Josh Hart. Josh Hart gives it to Dante DiVincenzo. He passes right back to McBride. McBride running point for the for the Knicks. He stops his dribble, gives it to Bodanovich. He shoots a three over top of Nicholas Batum, and he makes it. Gosh, Lee. All right, so it's 34 to 36, a two-point game, 10 minutes and seven seconds left in the second quarter. Oh, snap. But it is what it is. Let's go. Gives it to Tobias. Tobias wide open for a three. He could have shot that three. He got Josh Hart on him. He gives it to Paul Reed. Paul Reed gives it to Buddy Hill. Buddy Hill's driving to the lane. Driving to the lane. Easy layup. He misses it. Rebound by Dante DiVincenzo. He's driving. He's driving on uh, Tobias. Nope. No, he pulls it out. He gives it to Bodanovich. Bodanovich is being guarded by Nicholas Batoon. What you going to do? At the top of the key, he gets a scream by Robinson. Oh, good defense by Paul Reed. That should be a jump ball. Jump ball. Thank you, ref. Jump ball. He had all ball when he went up for that layup. It's not a foul, Bodanovich. It will be a jump ball. Paul Reed and Bodanovich will jump. Jump it up. Good defense by Paul Reed on that play. Good defense by Paul Reed on that play. Oh, I might have been in the squad. I just got to do my, uh, I, you know, I'm a, I'm a hybrid sports fan. Philly, everything besides football. Football, I got to do that. This is the most important NFL draft in a very long time, my guy. I would never abandon my Philadelphia senses. I'm going to still be covering them. I just won't be doing the play-by-play. -play. You feel me? Trust and believe I still will be covering them. You know the vibes with that. Let's go. Oh, it went out of bounds, and it will be – is it Sixer ball or Knicks ball? Wait, oh, come on, refs. Y'all look confused, bruh. So it's going to be Knicks ball. Come on, bruh. All right, nine minutes and 37 seconds left in the second quarter. Shout out to everybody in the building. Ingram, what's up, my guy? What's up, my guy? T.Y., what's up, my guy? Teacher guy game, and B is cooking. Yes. Yeah. And yeah, he, he cooking them both, bro. Let's go. Oh. McBride drives to the lane. Oh, is that a foul? No. Get out of here, bro. That wasn't all ball. Bro, bro y'all got to stop with this, bro. Like, we're not going to do that, bro. Let me see. Let me see. Oh, yeah, he did smack him on the hand. Yeah, that's a foul. That's a foul. I got to keep it real. That's a foul. All right, you got a chance to tie the game up to make it 36 to 36 in the second quarter. Yo, it's crazy when Joel Embiid gets out the game and make this run like this. Like, it's so crazy how good a player is that just makes everything look so much smoother bro like it's it's so crazy like like i know joel Embiid is a superstar i know joel Embiid is very good but it's just it's just so crazy how much he does on this team like when you not like when you talk about the just the the office alone he does his thing but then that defense bro that he brings every single game it, it, it it's it's so amazing bro like what he does on both sides of the court and that's why i like I always go Joel and B like that as like definitely my favorite player. <laughs> you know what I mean? Let's go. Tobias Harris gets a Nicholas with two. He gets it to Cameron Payne. Cameron Payne driving to the lane, driving to the lane. He puts up a floater, but he gets blocked by Robinson. Rebound by Paul Reed. Puts it up. Gets fouled. Oh, it doesn't get fouled, but it, he throws it off the gas, the glass, and it go and it goes in. 38 to 36. Hard shot by Paul Reed. He made it look easy. McBride with the ball being guarded by Cameron Payne. He gets it to Dante DiVincenzo. He gets a screen by Robinson. He doesn't use it. He Dante's driving. He kicks it out to Josh Hart for a wide open three, but he doesn't shoot the three. He passes it to Dante Jim Vincenzo and he shoots the three. He misses it. Rebound. Come on. Come on. Oh, dang. They got the rebound. Oh, man. Good recovery by Cameron Payne to knock the ball out of bounds. That would have been an easy layup for Dante Jim Vincenzo. But good defense by Cameron Payne. I'm a big fan of Cameron Payne, y'all. Like, I love, he's like, Perfect for the Sixers, y'all. Like, for real. I love when I see him play on this team. All right, let's go. Let's go. Is that Josh Hart? No, that's the Bodanovich for three. Misses it. Rebound by Tobias. Good job on the rebounding by Tobias Harris. I'm loving the rebounding from Toby. Let's go. Tyrese Massey going between his legs. Trying to cross up McBride. He looks like he gets a screen by Paul Reed. He's driving. Driving to the lane. Nope. Does a floater. Makes it look easy. Tyrese Maxi. Four-point game. 40-36. 40 to 36. Shout out to my bull Collins. Go Sixers. Shout out to everybody vibing with y'all. Boy. And there will be a full timeout by those Knicks. Yes. It will be a full timeout by the Knicks. We're making a little run, even though it's not really a little run. It's not really a run, but we're scoring at will. Tyrese Maxi, baby. Tyrese Maxi, baby.
Yeah, you thought it was sweet, Knicks. You thought it was sweet. We're not scared of the Knicks. I don't know why people are so scared of the Knicks. I don't know. I don't know. They should be scared of us. Anybody that goes against the Sixers, like I always say this. Yeah, they got they they got they dudes that can play, but we got our dudes that can play as well. That's why I always be telling people, like, I'm not scared of any team in the East. They might think I'm crazy when I say that, but I feel this, I really feel like that. Because I look at it like this. Yes, they got these players, but we got our players. They got to stop what we got. And we got a good coach, a great coach, a championship caliber coach. He won a championship, the only championship in Toronto history. Yeah. Where's Mo Bamba? Mo Bamba. I don't think Mo Bamba will get any miss, bro. <laughs> I'm just keeping it real, bro. I'm keeping it real. No hate on Mo Bamba because Mo Bamba, when he did play, he did all right sometimes. He Sometimes he looked a little not mean, but it is what it is. Shout out to, uh, he said, my boy Evan said, go Sixers. Yeah, man. Hit that like button. Yeah, shout out to Chris Frill for saying it. Hit that like button if you haven't already. Consider subscribing to your boy if you haven't already. It's definitely going down, man. We doing it big over here, man. It's definitely going down over here, man. I don't care what nobody says. We will win this game. It's definitely going down. I'm excited for the rest of this game. We're about to be at a halftime in 8 minutes and 16 seconds. Let's go Sixers, man. Let's go Sixers. Man, what an excitement. A, a, a very exciting time for the Philadelphia 76ers, man. Very exciting. Very exciting. I'm loving what I'm seeing, man. I'm loving what I'm seeing. All right, we're on a uh, commercial break. Still timeout, full timeout. Tyrese Maxey made that nice 10-foot driving floater, and it was nothing but net. It was nothing but net. Doing good, man. We're doing good, man. Let's keep it going. Let's make this four-point lead into a 10-point lead going into halftime. You know what I mean? Let's make this four-point game into a 20-point game. Shoot, make it a 30-point game, a 40-point game. Make it a 40-piece nugget game. It is what it is. Just make sure we up at the end of the day. That's all that matters to me. That's all that matters to me. I'm tired of all this hate for the Sixers giving us no chance. But I love the underdog story. If you want to say we're the underdog, so be it. We're not the normal seven seed that you're going against. You're going against a, a team with an MVP caliber player. You're going against a team with Tyrese Maxey, a first-time All-Star, and he is a star, by the way. You're going against a team with a championship-caliber head coach. You're not going against a normal seven seed. So all these people doubting, keep on doubting. Stephen A. Smith said five games. He said five games. Yeah, we're going to see about that. Keep that same energy, bro. Keep that same energy, bro. My boy said, for, my said, boy said forget. He said, forget Paul George, let Buddy Hill walk, and y'all should get Kelly, uh, Clay Thompson. He, he would be the perfect fit for y'all. Oh, no, it depends on the paper. It depends on the paper. I do like Clay Thompson. I do like Clay Thompson. It depends on that paper, though. Like, it depends on how much he wants, and we'll go from there. But let's go. Oh, is that McBride going for the layup? He misses it, but they get the offensive rebound. They put it back up, and they missed it again. Robinson missed the bunny. Good job, Robinson. Good job, Robinson. Let's go. Six offensive rebounds for the Knicks, man. Tyrese Maxey gets fouled. All right, by Bodanovich. All right. Let's go. Let's go. All right, Tyrese Maxey with the ball. Gets a screen by Nicholas Batoon. Gets a double screen by Paul Reed as well. Shoots a midi. Misses it. Oh. Rebound by Bodine. Bo oh, let's go. Oh, come on, bro. They be calling these little ticky tack fouls, bro. 40 to 36, Knicks ball. All right, so he, what did he do? Oh, he hit his hand a little bit. Okay. All right, let's go. Dante DiVincenzo inbounds the ball to McBride. McBride with the ball, being guarded by Cameron Payne. He fakes the pass to Josh Harper. Then he gives it to Bodanovich. Don Bodanovich gives it to Dante DiVincenzo. Then he gives it to McBride. McBride gives it to Josh Hart. Josh Hart passes to McBride. He stops his drill, gives it to Josh Hart. Josh Hart's driving on Nicholas Batum, puts up a shot, and he misses it. Get the rebound. Oh, my gosh, bro. Tell me that's not a dang. Oh, you're okay, Max? He's grabbing his knee. Hopefully he's okay. Is that a shooting foul?
Oh my gosh, bro. So it's going to be a shooting foul. But he landed on my bull, Tyrese Maxey. Like, he landed on his knee, bro. Josh Hart, what are you trying to do, bro? Yo, Josh Hart, what are you trying to do, bro? I don't like that. I don't like that one bit, bro. I don't like that one bit, bro. All right, let's go. Let's go. Tyrese Maxey with the ball. 40 to 38, seven minutes and 29 seconds left in the first half. Let's go. Cameron Payne falls to the ground, gives it to Paul Reed. Paul Reed gives it to Tyrese Maxey. Tyrese Maxey shoots the three from outer space, misses it, rebound by Josh Hart. I don't really like that shot. Josh Hart with the ball, driving to the lane on Paul Reed, puts it up, and he misses it, but the put back by Robinson, the game is tied 40 to 40. Seven minutes and 10 seconds left in the sec second quarter. Joel Embiid is coming back in the game. Let's go. Tobias Harris with the ball. Gets a screen by Paul Reed. Gives it to Paul. Oh, gives it to Paul Reed. Gives it right back to Tobias Harris. Tobias Harris gives it. Oh, oh he throws up a little. There's only one way to eat cookies with protein. Yeah, it's cheating. I don't know why these commercials pop up so quick. All right, but yeah, man. Hold on. They call that an offensive foul? Yo, I got to see that. I got to see that play again. I don't care about this play. They show showing the wrong play. Show the offensive foul to Tobias Harris. There you go. I don't know. Would that be it? I don't know. I think they're not going to challenge that. Yeah, that was a good shot by Tobias, unfortunately. He has three, three personal fouls. Joel Embiid, I think, has two. Hopefully, he only has one. I got to double check on that. Four turnovers by the Sixers, three turnovers by the Knicks. Let's, 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 let's keep playing Sixer basketball. We got this. Let's go. Tied up 40 to 46 minutes and 43 seconds. Jalen Brunson shoots a three, misses it. Rebound by Kelly Oubre Jr. He gets it to Tyrese Maxey. Tyrese Maxey with the ball. Let's go. Let's go. Screen by Joel B. Tyrese Maxey looking for Joel B. Joel B. Oh, I thought he was going to shoot that three. He has Robinson going between his legs. He's about to cross up. Robinson does a step back. Midi, 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 midi. Misses it. Rebound by McBride. McBride with the ball. Being guarded by Kelly Oubre Jr. He gives it to OG Anobi. OG Anobi gives it to Bodanovich. He's backing down Tyrese. The double team comes. He puts up a shot. Misses it, but he gets fouled. Going to the free throw line for two. Yeah, he fell on Tyrese Maxey's leg. Look like, I don't know, bro. I be kind of iffy about that. Like, of all the places you fall, look like you falling on my bull's leg. Like, what is you doing, bro? It's all good. This is a game of runs. It's all good. They miss, he missed the first free throw. It's still 40 to 40. It's a game of runs. Bodanovich. At the free throw line for another another chance. He has eight points. Shoots it. Misses both free throws. Rebound by Joel Embiid. Good job. Good job, Bodanovich. Miss all your free throws. Keep it up. Keep it up. Cheers to that. Let's go. Joel Embiid with the ball. He gives it to Tyrese. Tyrese uses a screen by Joel Embiid. He passes it to Joel Embiid. Joel Embiid with the ball. Uh-oh. Joel Embiid. Oh, what you going to do with it? Oh, he almost loses the ball. Joel Embiid regains control of the ball. He shoots a three. Misses it badly, and it will be a turnover. Shot clock violation on the Philadelphia 76ers. The ball movement on that particular play was not good, but let's go. Let's go. Defense now. Defense now, y'all. Jalen Brunson with the ball. Three turnovers by the Sixers in this quarter. Zero turnovers by the Knicks. Bodanovich with a corner three. Misses it. Rebound by OG Anobi over Kelly Uber. We cannot let that happen. Oh, my gosh. Jalen Brunson with the ball. Being guarded by... By uh oh my gosh, ah, mm. all right, let's go, let's go, man, let's go. Forty-two to forty, swings it to Nicholas Batum. Nicholas Batum almost turns the ball over to regain. Oh, bounce pass to Ke Ka oh, let's go. Wide open three by Kelly Uber Jr. for three, misses it. Rebound by Bodanovich. Oh man, he gets it to Jalen Brunson. Jalen Brunson being guarded by Kyle Lowry. He's driving. He's driving. He's trying to take Kyle Lowry. He shoots a fadeaway midi. Misses it. Rebound by Joel Embiid. Joel Embiid with the with the rebound. Point center. Joel Embiid with the ball. 
Looks like he's going to take him. He's going to take Robinson. He take it to him. Puts it up. Getting fouled. Going to the free throw line for two. Freaking go, baby. Can't guard that ball, man. Stop playing with me. Stop playing with this dude, man. Disrespect. The disrespect is too real, man. We need someone else to step up, though. Like, someone else has to really score. It can't just be Joel Embiid. It has to be somebody else. Somebody else has to wake up and help Joel Embiid score. Tyrese Maxey, Kelly Oubre Jr., Tobias Harris, somebody else has to come through on the offensive side of the ball. It cannot just be Joel Embiid creating and scoring. It has to be everybody else. Someone else has to help. Somebody else has to help. A game of runs and attacking the zone. Facts. It's Joel Embiid. Yeah. yeah. Let's go. Let's go. Joel Embiid with the, at the free throw line for another one. And he makes, oh, and he misses it. All right, so 42 to 41, one point game, one, four minutes and 51 seconds left in that second quarter. Jalen Brunson being guarded by Nicholas Batoon. He gets a screen, but he gives it to Bodanovich. Bodanovich gives it to a wide open OG Anobi, and OG Anobi misses it, but they get the offensive rebound. McBride with the ball shoots a three, and he will make it. See, those are the stuff that really irritates me. The offensive rebounds irritate me so freaking much. Four point game. Timeout by Nick Nurse. Timeout by Nick Nurse. The offensive rebounds irritate me because I know we need to get our rebounds. We have to get our rebounds, bro. Like, I, I say that every game, and I say it for a reason. Because when you do not get your defensive rebounds and you give multiple possessions to the opposing team, that means they're going to have more of a chance to get buckets on you because they have more possessions. So, therefore, box out and get your defensive rebounds. That's the only knock I have in this first half. We're giving up too many offensive rebounds. That's it. Everything else I like so far, turnovers are starting to pile up a tiny, tiny bit. But other than that, it's the rebounding. The offensive rebounding has to stop. We need to get our defensive rebounds. We need to get our defensive rebounds. That is one of the most important things in a playoff series. It's rebounding the ball, mainly on the defensive side of the ball. That McBride three wouldn't have happened if we would have got the defensive rebound, period. That one rebound, OG Anobi beast molding, my bull Kelly Oubre Jr. for that rebound cannot happen. We have to get our defensive rebounds, period. Period. That's just what it has to be. That's just what it has to be. But shout out to everybody rocking with your bull. If you haven't already, hit that like button, hit that like button, hit that like button. Consider subscribing to your bull. I do play-by-play -play for most of the Philadelphia 76 games this season. It's definitely going down. Shout out to everybody in the building. You know the all vibes. You know how we coming. You know what we doing. Yup. How that. Yup. That's how you win. Talk that talk. Talk that talk. Yeah, we got to get the rebounders, man. We have to get the rebounds. That rebound. Like, we were giving up too many rebounds. Like, period. Period. This is a shame. Dang. But, yeah, man, we're going to see what happens, man. We're going we're gonna, to we're gonna improve on these rebounds, I hope, hopefully. Um, we got four minutes and 30 seconds left in the first quarter, but we have to make sure we do our thing in the second half and rebound, 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 rebound the key. If we keep doing what we're doing and someone else has to step up when it comes to the offensive side of the ball, don't matter who it is. I don't even care if it, I don't care who it is. It has, somebody else has to uh, really step their game up. We need someone else to score. We need someone else to score because uh, they're, they're going to really start doubling du Joel and B. They're not going to let him just cook all game. It's just not going to happen. So let's go. It is what it is. Let's go. Yeah, the rebounding has been like that all year, but we yeah, we have to do better. I mean, we got to improve it. We got to improve it. All right, four minutes and 30 seconds left in the first half. In the second quarter. The Philadelphia 76ers are losing 41 to 45. 41 to 45. 
Tyrese Maxey gives it to Tobias Harris. Tobias Harris makes the three. He gives it to Tyrese Maxey. Tyrese Maxey gives it to Tobias Harris. Oh, no, I'm looking at replays. My bad, y'all. I'm looking at replays. My bad. <laughs> All right, let's go. Tyrese Maxey with the ball. He going between his legs. He gives it to Joel B. Joel B has Robinson on him. He's about to cook him. You got to go fast. He's going. The double team's going to come. He fouls Joel B. Are they in the penalty? Robinson's shaking his head. That's not a foul. That's not a foul. All right. Whatever. All right. Oh, oh, turnover. Come on. Recover, Kelly. Oh, he just likes some don't. All right, 47 to 41, 47 to 41. Six point game. Let's go. Kelly Oubre Jr. with the ball. Gives it to Joel Embiid. Joel Embiid gives it to Kyle Lowry. Kyle Lowry gets a screen by Joel Embiid. He, oh, what's he going to do with it? He's going he's gonna to find Joel Embiid again. And then there's almost a turnover right there. Come on. What are y'all doing? Bounce pass to Joel Embiid. Joel Embiid gives it to Nicholas Batoon. He gives it to a wide open Tyrese Manson for corner three. Makes it, baby. Put the threes in the chat. Put the threes in the chat, man. Stop playing games. 44 to 47. 44 to 47. Three-point game. Three minutes and 40 seconds left in the second quarter. Jalen Brunson with the ball. Being guarded by Nicholas Batoon. Gets a screen by Robinson, but he recovers. He gets another screen by Robinson. He shoots the midi over Nicholas Batoon. Get the rebound. Get the rebound. Oh, it's out of bounds on the Knicks, and it will be Sixer basketball. Kyle Lowry going to inbound the ball. Good pass by Joel Embiid. Good pass by Nicholas Batum for that nice corner three. Good ball movement from the 76ers, bro. Let's go. Nicholas Batum gives it to Tyrese Maxey. Tyrese Maxey looking for Joel Embiid. Looking for Joel Embiid. Oh, he shoots the three. Misses it. Oh, dang. Oh, my gosh. He's wide open. Oh, my gosh. A wide open McBride for a dunk. Transition point. We got to get, we got to get back on defense. 49 to 44. Three minutes left in the second quarter. Joel Embiid. Stops his dribble, passes it to Kyle Lowry. Kyle Lowry gives it right back to Joel Embiid. Joel Embiid's looking around. He's, oh, he, oh, oh my gosh. He threw it off the backboard. Oh no, tell me he didn't hurt himself. No. He's on the ground, y'all. I don't know what to say right now. I don't know what to say, bro. I don't know what to say. I don't even know. I don't, I don't have no words right now. I'm keeping it real. Don't know what to say. Um, what a terrific play. But um, dang. Uh, hopefully he's all right. I don't know what's going on right now. Um, as soon as he threw it off the backboard and dunked it on Bull, he. Landed on his one leg and he just went down to the ground, went to the pain and laid and laid on the ground. So I'm just hoping it's nothing. Um, but I don't know what to say, bro. I don't, bro. Teacher got him. I, I it is his knee. I'm not sure if it's the surgical repair knee. I don't know, but it's a damn shame because at the end of the day, he's dominating the Knicks. Knicks have no answer. Um if everybody else gets it together offensively, Sixers, we got this game, bro. We can win. We're definitely going to win this game. It's just, I don't know what to say. I'm just hoping Joel Embiid is good, man. This is crazy. Is he still on the floor? Paul Reese in the game. That's not a good sign. All right. Tyrese Massey gets the screen by Paul Reed. He loses the ball. Is out of bounds. It's going to be. Oh, stop showing the same thing on play, bro. Like, damn. Oh. No, he's going to the locker room, y'all. 
The Knicks fans are clapping for Joel and B. That's good. That's what's up. Wow. Dang. I don't know. He's going to the locker room, y'all. Hopefully he's all right. Um, we got to get through the second half, this first half without him. Let's see what happens. Let's go. Hopefully Joel and B is all right. Tyrese Maxey with the ball. He drives. Oh, he drives. Bounce past the Kyle Lowry. He fakes the three. He shoots the three. Puts it up. Air balls the three. But it goes out of bounds, and it will be Knicks ball. 51-46 to 46 with two minutes and 15 seconds left in the second quarter. Come on, y'all. Let's go. Let's go. It ain't about nothing. Let's go. Talk that Let's talk. Let's go fix it, baby. Come on. Play that defense. It ain't nothing. Joel Embiid will be back. Let's go. Let's speak it into existence, y'all. Joel Embiid will be back. Jalen Brunson with the ball. Let's make a run without him. Let's go. Jalen Brunson gets a screen by Robinson. He gives it to, it looks like OG Anobi. OG Anobi is does a bounce pass to McBride for Mitty. Misses it. Rebound by Nicholas Batum. He gives it to Tyrese Maxey. Come on, we need a bucket right here. We need a bucket right here. Tyrese Maxey driving. He driving. Driving to the lane. Oh, he gets blocked by Robinson. And he throws it off of Tyrese Maxey. Good play. Whew. All right, let's go. Jalen Brunson with the ball calling a play. Let's go. Being guarded by Nicholas Mattoon. Let's go. No, the switch. Tyrese Maxey's on him. Going behind his back. Almost loses the ball. Come on. Good defense, Tyrese. Let's go. Jalen Brunson shoots it. Gets fouled. Going to the free throw line for two. Golly. Oh, my gosh, bro. Mike, this is not good at all. Bro, I hope he will be back, bro. Like, I, I'm I'm, a, I'm speaking into existence, bro. I'm speaking into existence. Like, it is what it is. We got it. We, we got it. I'm speaking into existence, bro. I, he's he's having such a great game. I, I don't want him to like this. The Sixers got a chance to win this game. We could take we could take um this game. We can take this game. They're, but somebody else has to step up um offensively. But like I don't know, man. This is this 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 is crazy. I just hope the best. That's, that's, that's all I can say. I just gotta hope the best, man. Gotta hope the best. Like, let's go. Sixers, man. Joel Embiid went to the locker room. That, that is crazy, bro. That is crazy. I don't even know what to say. He said, it's over, Mike. Nah, man. I'm not going for it. All right, so 53 to 46. Let's go. Let's go. Let's go. Kyle Lowry gives it to Paul Reed. Paul Reed gives it to Kelly Uber Jr. He's driving, 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 goes to the lane. Uh, misses the layup off the backboard. Rebound by the Knicks. Jalen Brunson with the ball. He gives it to McBride for a three. He makes it. Oh, my gosh. That's the guy I was talking about. That's the one guy that you really got to play defense on. McBride, Dante, Josh Hart's all right. And Jalen Brunson on the on, on, when it comes to threes. Let's go. Tyrese Messi going hard in the paint. Gets, oh. Paul Reed with the ball. Oh, my gosh. Come on. You should have put that up. Come on. Oh, man. We're not. We're not. We cannot buy a basket right now. We cannot buy a basket right now. McBride is destroying us from three. And then Paul Reed right there should have went up. Why did he bring the ball down? Why did you bring the ball down? Go up with the ball. When he got that offensive rebound, he should have went straight up with it. Hartus Nine shoots the first free throw, makes it. 11-point game. Dang. I hope the Sixers' confidence is not down. We got this, y'all. We got this, y'all. Come on. Yeah, I need an ad block for real, bro. I don't even know why this joint is, like, playing, like. But, yeah, Kyle Lowry with the ball. What you going to do with it? He's driving, driving, driving. Gives it to Nicholas with two for a corner three. Please make it. He misses it. Oh, Josh Hart with the rebound. Come on, y'all. 58 to 46. It's not over. Let's go. Jalen Brunson fakes the three. He's being guarded by Tyrese Maxey. He's bringing it back out to wind some of this time off. That's exactly, shoot. Trying to cross up Tyrese Maxey. Stops his dribble. Gives it to uh, McBride for three. And he finally misses it. 
but they get the offensive rebound. Bodanovich gives it to Jalen Brunson. They're going to wind the rest of the dang on quarter out. Oh, my gosh, bro. We got to get our, our defensive rebound. Oh, he loses the ball. It's going to be six or ball. We have to get our rebounds, y'all. We have to in this second half. Five, four, three, two, one. Oh. 46 to 58. 12 point game, halftime. Man, Joel B, we got to hope he comes back. We got to hope he comes back. How do you know he's not coming back, though, Ingram? I mean, he might come back. Uh, yeah, AJ. Shout out to AJ in the building. Yeah, teacher got game. He'll be back. Oh uh, man, I don't even know what to say, bro. Like I'm a little like frustrated right now. I'm not gonna lie. I'm a little like, yo, this is crazy, man. Look, another ad is holding up. Like I don't know, man. Like let me just look at the halftime stats real quick. I'm, I don't know. I feel some type of way right now. I ain't gonna lie, bro. Because this game would not be like this, bro. Like, they up by 12, bro. They up by 12. Not like that's a lot of points, but it's like, bro, they're not doing nothing special. The only thing is we got we got to get our freaking rebounds, bro. Like, rebounding is an issue, bro. Matter of fact, let me, excuse me. Let me look at the team stats real quick. First half, the Knicks got 11 offensive rebounds, bro. Like, come on, bro. Come on, bro. We're shooting 31% from three. And we're giving up offensive rebounds. So that's really what it is right now. Roland B got 18 points in the first half, two assists and five rebounds, 16 minutes. Um, Tyrese Maxey has 12. And guess what? Nobody else has anything close to double figures besides them two. Paul Reed has four. Nicholas Batoon has three. Tobias Harris has three. Kyle Larry has three. Kelly Oubre Jr. has three. You know what I mean? Like, it's not looking good. Someone else has to step their game up. It cannot just be on the shoulders of Joel Embiid and Tyrese Maxey to do everything. Somebody else has to do something, anticipate, per, let me, participate in the scoring because, like, especially Joel Embiid, I don't know how bad the injury is. Hopefully it's nothing. He did walk to the locker room, which is good. But the bad is he walked to the locker room. So I'm just hoping that it's nothing crazy. And this it just sucks. Sucks. But um we shall see what happens, man. I don't even know what to say, bro. I'm not gonna lie to y'all, man. I'm not gonna sit here and lie to y'all. I don't know what to say right now. I'm kind of like, yeah, I'm a little frustrated. I'm not gonna lie. Cause I know how this team played with Joel and B and him not playing, bruh. Did you see the look in his eye, bro? He gets hurt on his very first dunk since being back from injured. Yeah. Yeah. He's balling, man. Yeah, did you, yeah, I did see the look, and that was crazy, but Embiid has the look on his face. He's so disappointed. I don't think he will return. Oh, don't say that. I did see the look on his face. I just hope that y'all all are wrong. <laughs> like, I'm hoping y'all wrong. But um, let me, I'm, I'll be right back, y'all. Half time, I'll be right back, y'all. Half time. Be right back, y'all.
are both Um, hold on. Is Drell and B back? Hey, Drell and B's back. What? Oh my gosh, he shoots the three. Air balls it, but rebound by Kelly Oubre Jr. Out of bounds. It's going to be Sixers ball still. Oh, snap. I got a little down a little. I said, no, please, no. Please, no. Not the, not Joel and B. Please, no. Woo. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Hold on, y'all. Let me get something up real quick. All right, Tyrese Maxey with the ball. He's driving to the lane. Shoots up a midi. Misses it. Rebound by Dante DiVincenzo. Fast break, Jalen Brunson. Wow. Gets the layup. 60 to 46. 60 to 46. Let's go. Let's go, Joel. Domination. We're going to come back. By the way, we're not. We're going to come back. Just letting y'all know that. Just for people that think that this is going to be a blowout. No, it's not. It's definitely not. Just for the people that think this is going to be a blowout, it's not. It's not going to be like that. For the people that don't that don't believe, we're going to win this game. Let's go. Jalen Brunson with the ball. Puts up a floater. Misses it. He gets his, oh, he gets his rebound. Puts Dante DiVincenzo shoots a three. He misses it. They get another offensive rebound. OG Anobi with the ball. He's, little, he's driving on Tobias. He puts up a layup, and he gets it in. Come on, bro. These offensive rebounds are driving me crazy, bro. Like, I'm not even going to sit here and lie to y'all, bro. Let's go. Tyrese Messi gives it to Joel B. gives it to Tobias. Tobias gives it to a Kyle Lowry for a corner three, and he makes it. Put the threes in the chat. Put the threes in the chat. Put the threes in the chat. Stop playing games. Stop playing games. Let's go. Let's go. 51 to 62. 51 to 62. Let's go. 10 minutes left in the third quarter. The comeback is under works. Let's go. Jalen Brunson with the ball. He shoots a three and he will make it. Mm. 65 to 61. 14 point game. 10 minutes left in the third. Kyle Lowry gets a screen by Joel B. He gives it to Joel B. Joel B. gives it right back to Kyle Lowry. Kyle Lowry fakes the three. He gives it to Kelly Oubre Jr. Kelly Oubre Jr. travels, and it will go right back to the New York Knicks. Nine minutes and 53 seconds left in the third quarter. The Philadelphia 76ers need to take care of the basketball. They need to take care of the basketball and rebound the freaking ball. This rebounding is absolutely trash on the defensive side of the ball. Rebound the ball. Box out and rebound. Dante DiVincenzo gives it to Jalen Brunson. Jalen Brunson being guarded by Kyle Lowry gets a screen by Hart to sign. And it goes out of bounds and it will remain Nick's ball. It will remain Nick's ball. 65 to 51, nine minutes and 39 seconds left in the third quarter. All right, let's go. Deepa Chizzo inbounding the ball. Oh, a turnover. Kyle Lowry with the ball. Fast break, baby. He gets it in and lay up. Let's go. And is it and one? Hopefully it's and one. Yeah, and one, baby. Let's freaking go. Stop playing games with us, man. Stop playing games with the Sixers, man. We're not giving up on this game. We're going to win this game, bro. We're taking game one, bro. It's going to be a beat down in the fourth quarter. I'm calling it right now. Kyle Lowry with the ball. I mean, Kyle Lowry with the uh, chance to make it a three-point play. He has eight points in this game so far. Let's freaking go, man. And he does make it. It is an 11-point game. Let's play good defense. Let's keep it up. Let's keep it up. Jalen Brunson with the ball. Being guarded by Kelly Oubre Jr. Let's go. Gets a screen by Dante DiVincenzo. The switch. Tyrese gets another screen by Hartenstein. He's driving on top on Joel Embiid. Puts up a floater over top of Joel Embiid. That was a hard shot. I got to give it to him for that shot. Wow. Let's go. Kyle Lowry with the ball. Gives it to Tyrese Maxey. Tyrese Maxey, what you going to do? He's driving. Gets a screen by Joel Embiid. Passes to Joel Embiid. Joel Embiid is going to shoot the three. No, he doesn't shoot the three. Passes it up to Tyrese. Tyrese 
He's driving to the lane, driving to the lane, going hard in the paint, reverse layup off the backboard. Oh, my gosh. That layup was nasty. Tyrese Maxey is something special, y'all. It's back to 11-point game. Jalen Brunson with the ball. Eight minutes and 57 seconds left in the third quarter. Jalen Brunson with the ball. Gets a screen by Dante DiVincenzo. The switch is Tyrese Maxey's on him. Bounce pass to Hartenstein. He almost loses the ball, but he regains control. He gives it to OG Anobi. He's been guarded by Kyle Lowry. Come on, someone help him out. Hartenstein driving on Tobias Harris. Puts up a shot, a hook shot. Ugly shot, Re but he misses it. That's good. Rebound by Tobias. Tobias gives it to Kyle Lowry. Kyle Lowry looking to, gives it to Joel Embiid. Joel Embiid fakes the three. Then he's going to, oh, he's going to give it to Tyrese Maxey. Let's go. He gives it to Kyle Lowry for three. Hit him, Maxey, baby. Let's go, Sixers. Let's go. 59 to 67. The comeback is about to happen. Let's go. Let's go. Shout out to the people in the back. Shout out to the people in the right. Shout out to the people in the left. If you haven't already, hit that like button. Consider subscribing to your bull play-by-play -play for most of the Philadelphia 7 the games this season. It's definitely going down. Join the YouTube family. Let's go. Mike Sports Vibes, thank you for vibing with me. Yeah. No, no, no. I ain't retired from the chat. I ain't retired, bro. I'm back. I'm back. Yeah. Yeah, 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 I'm back, bro. I'm back. Let's go. Let's go. Yeah, Joel B is back. <laughs> yeah, yeah. Let's go, baby. Let's go, baby. Let's go. Oh, man. Inga, you be thinking, of, bro, you said ACL. Bro, we got to. Come on, bro. Come on, bro. We can't be think Because, like, sometimes the thing that you speak, can, it, it comes to reality. We don't want none of that. We don't want none of that. You feel me? We don't want none of that. Yo, shout out to everybody rocking with your boy. If you haven't already, hit that like button, hit that like button, hit that like. Yo, Malik Savage, I didn't know you. I don't know if I seen you in the chat, but shout out to my boy Malik Savage. I want to give a big shout out to uh, Malik. I want to give a big shout out to everybody that's in the chat. I'm going to say this real quick. I want. I got to get this off my chest. Everybody that's on this live, if y'all listening to me right now, everybody, I want to say this. Everybody is entitled to their own opinion about anything, right? I might not agree. Y'all might not agree with me. But as long as we could di agree to disagree, it is what it is. Respectfully. You know what I'm saying? So if you feel like, because my bull, I got I to gotta say this. I'm, if you feel like a certain player is good or a certain player isn't good, like, for example, Paul George, you think he's good, and you, or some people think he's trash. Some people think he's this. Somebody, you know what I mean? Everybody's entitled to their own opinion. Um, I just want to let y'all know that. And I wanted to say thank you for everybody. Like, everybody that's on this chat, on this live right now, I truly appreciate y'all, man. Y'all always been rocking with me from for a minute. Like, I don't know how long T.Y. was rocking for me, but he's been rocking with me for a minute. Malik, I don't even know how long. It's been a minute. Been a long time for Malik. So shout out to y'all. Uh, people that has been in and out of chat, like Teacher Got Game. Big Task been rocking with me for a minute, even though he is a Knicks fan. Yo, why wouldn't B make a move like that? Yeah, I know. He's trying to do and one. I don't know why. But shout out to Big um Big Task. Um, who else was in the chat? Ron's opinion, Chris For Real, AJ, uh, Too Evil. There's a few people that's been in and out of the chat, but shout out to each and every one of y'all. I just want to thank y'all and uh appreciate y'all, man, for vibing with me for a minute. I really do. New York Knicks, they are a real deal. Mike said Knicks have nobody looked at. Yeah, yeah. They don't, bro. I'm trying to tell you. They're still going to lose, bro. They don't have enough, in my opinion. That's just my opinion, bro. I might be wrong, but I still feel like they don't got enough. They don't, bro. They was getting cooked. They was getting cooked. You take Joel and B out the game, look what happened. They made their run. Correct me if I am wrong, y'all. When did they make their run? When Joel and B went out of the game. Not before. I'm not talking about when he got hurt. I'm talking before that. When he went on the bench for like a good seven, whatever minutes it was, they made their run. They came all the way back. When he, I'm trying to tell y'all, bro. I'm like, well, we're going to see what happens. We're going to see. They look good, the, the, the Knicks, but they're not going to win this game. Let's go. Fast break points. Knicks got 20. Jalen Brunson shoots a three, misses it, rebound by the Knicks again. Yo, I'm get yo, I don't know what to say, bro. Dante DiVincenzo with the ball. What's he gonna do? He passes it to Jalen Brunson. 
Jalen Brunson driving on Kelly Oubre Jr. Puts up a shot, but he gets blocked from behind by Kelly Oubre Jr. Great defense. Is it a foul? Get the f Yo, get out of here with that. I hit him with the nah, bro. Hit him with the nah, nah bro. bro. For real, man. Hit him nah. With the nah, bro. Yo. Nah, hit him with the nah, bro. Nah, but I'm talking about when he went on the bench before he got hurt. Y'all, like when he, y'all, we was beating y'all by like 12 points. Eight points. He went on the bench for seven minutes and y'all came back. But it, it don't even matter, honestly. We got to win this game. Let's go. D Dante DiVincenzo driving to the lane, misses it. Oh my gosh. It's going to be sixer ball, 59 to 67. It is what it is. We're going to win this game. I'm going to, I'm telling y'all we're going to win this game. Y'all don't want to believe me? Watch. Watch. Y'all going to see. Tyrese Massey with the ball. Gets a screen by Joel B. Bounce back to Joel B. Joel B gives it to Kyle Lowry. Kyle Lowry for a wide open three again. Ah, he misses it. But he gets fouled. Let's freaking go. Oh, Kyle Lowry is going to the line for three. Hold on. Let me just make sure that's what happened. Yeah, he going to the line for three, bruh. He going to the line for three, bruh. Hold on. Is that a three or is that going to be a two? Hold on. Let me double check. Do that replay again. Do that replay again, bruh. Do that replay again, bruh. Do that replay again, bruh. Knicks got Jalen Brunson and a bunch of three-point shooters that can that are really good shooters. But I'm trying to tell you, bro, I'm trying to tell you, bro, we got this series, bro. I'm trying to tell y'all now. Y'all don't want to listen. Watch, watch, watch what happens in this game. Watch y'all. Y'all think that I'm joking when I say this? We're gonna beat them in the fourth quarter, but it's gonna be a beat down in the fourth. I, bro, I, I'm trying to tell y'all. I'm trying to tell you, y'all, y'all don't understand. Y'all not understanding me, but y'all gonna understand. We y'all gonna understand. The season's about to show up. The season's about to show off, y'all. I'm trying to tell y'all. Got me drinking this Deer Park water, trying to make sure I'm hydrated. Yeah, he steps on his foot. Why are you stepping on my guy's foot, bro? Why are you stepping on my guy's foot, bro? Well, did he push his leg out, though? Hopefully, they don't call that. Hopefully, they don't say that he put his foot out. Yeah, no, they're going big. That's a three. You got to give him shooting. You got to give him a, a shoot, a landing spot. You got to give him a landing spot. So, if he hits these threes, we back. We we, we on business, bro. All right, he made it. Seven-point game. Seven-point game, y'all. 60 to 67. We still got two more free throws to go, baby. We still got two free throws to go, baby. Let's go. Mike Sports Vibes, thank you for vibing with me. Shout out to the people in the building, man. I appreciate you. All right, let's go. Yeah, it's a six-point game. Yeah, yeah, let's go. What's up, Knicks fans? What's up? Can he make it a five-point game? Can he, ma can, can he make it a five-point game? <laughs> let's go. Let's go. Kyle Lowry at the free throw line. One more. One more. Make it, baby. Make it, baby. And he does. Five-point game. Let's Man, shoot, let me talk that talk, man. Talk playing that game, man. talk. You see the run when that bull Joel B comes back? Yeah, there's a reason for that. The alter shots from the defensive side of the ball. Josh Hart with the ball. What you going to do with it? What you going to do with it? He stops his dribble, bounce past the Hart time. He gives it to OJ number for easy dunk. 69 and 62, seven-point game. Seven minutes and eight seconds left in the third quarter. Philadelphia Center Station and the New York Knicks are battling. Who will win this game? If you haven't already, hit that like button. Consider subscribing to your bull play-by-play -play for most of the sister games this season. Let's go. Tyrese Massey with the ball. Bounce pass to Joel B. Joel B is, oh, he's about to cook hard to start going between his legs. All oh, snap. All oh, snap. Seven on the shot clock. Seven on the shot clock. He's backing him down. He's going hard in the paint. A little hook shot. Misses it. Oh. Rebound by OG. And nobody gets it to Jalen Brunson. Jalen Brunson looking around, observing the court. Being guarded by Tyrese, he shoots a three from outer space, and he misses it. But Joel B with the rebound. Joel B gives it to Kyle Lowry. Kyle Lowry gives it to Tyrese Massey. Tyrese Massey gives it to Kyle Lowry. Kyle Lowry driving to the lane. Nope, he kicks it out to Kelly Oubre Jr. He fakes the three, gives it to Joel B. Joel B will not shoot the three. He gives it to Tyrese. Tyrese is looking around. He's driving to the lane, driving to the lane. Layup. Let's go, baby. Let's go, baby. Ooh, that ball nice. 64 to 69. 
64 to 69 with six minutes and 13 seconds left in the third quarter. We will dominate them in the fourth quarter. Let's go, Sixers. Y'all thought I was playing when I said what I said. Let's go. Josh Hart with the ball. What you going to do with it, bro? What you going to do? Bounce past the heart to stop. He shoots the hook shot. Misses it. Rebound by Tobias Harris. Let's go. Tobias Harris with the ball. He's looking around, observing the court. Looking around, observing the court. Gets it to Tyrese Maxey. Let's go. Let's go. Tyrese Maxey. In the half court, he up, oh, he stops his dribble. It looks like he's driving. He's driving a hard to stop. He puts up a floater layup and he gets it in. Makes it look easy. He made him look crazy. It's a three-point game. Let's go. Mike Sports Vibes. Thank you for the Knicks call full timeout. The Knicks call full timeout. When that bull Joel and B got back, now what? They made their run when Joel and B wasn't in the game. They made their run when Joel and B was hurt going to the locker room. They made their run then. Now that he's back, now look, it's not all about just scoring. It's about holding it down in the paint. The presence, the swag of the Sixers is just different with that MVP caliber player named Joel Embiid. Can I talk that talk? Talk that talk. People want to doubt. People want to say this and that. It is what it is. You are, you're entitled to your opinion. But what I would say is my opinion counts as well. And I'm going to talk my talk about it. And I'm going to say that when Joel Embiid is in the game, he controls and he does so much. And that's why we will blow out the Knicks in the fourth quarter. I'm calling it. Y'all don't want to listen to me. Watch. The blowout, we're going to come back in this third quarter all the way back. I'm talking about we're going to have the lead going into the fourth. Y'all think I'm lying. Y'all think I'm lying. Watch fourth quarter beat down. We win about like 15 points. Bet. I'm not gonna bet, but I, I'm, I, I'm, I'm not gonna guarantee it. But I have a feeling, bro. I have a feeling it's gonna be a beat down in the fourth. Y'all don't understand that they don't have enough. I just don't think they do. OG Anobi, he's a very, 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 very good player, but he ain't that good. You know what I mean? Jalen Brunson, he's a very, very, very good player. I ain't going to say he ain't that good because he really is that good. But other than that, they got McBride can shoot the three. You know what I'm saying? They got Dante DiVincenzo. He can shoot the three. Yeah, yeah, they do have that. But if you shut that all down, it's hard, easier said than done. Bro, who do they have after Jalen Brunson, bro? Really? Who really? Who do they really have? I'm just saying, bro. Just my opinion. I might be wrong. But that's just my opinion. I think we got this game. Let me get to the chat real quick. Let me get to the chat real quick. I know y'all talking. Y'all talk right now. Hey, shout out to Ingram in the shout out to Zoe in the building. Shout out to my bull Zoe in the building. Shout out to my guy. Is currently pitching a no hitter. Oh my gosh, yo, this Philly's been balling right now. Lakers in seven. Nah, that's not happening. That's not happening. That's not happening, bro. We're not going to stop that. We're not going to start the capping with the Lakers. I mean, I like I like LeBron. I do like Anthony Davis, but nah, bro. They're not doing that. Um, It's up to Nurse to draw up some plays. Yeah. Sixers fans for life. You already know the vibes, right? Let's go. Ron's opinion don't matter. Um, Whoever can we in the road game going to win the series? Yeah, that's true. But yeah, man, I'm not, man, I'm not worrying about this, bro. I'm not worrying about that. That's right, Lakers. Nah, stop. No, stop it. Nah, stop it. Y'all tripping. Y'all tripping. Not happening. Not happening. But shout out to everybody in the building. If you haven't already, hit the like button. Hit the like button. Consider subscribing to your bull. You already know the vibes, man. We doing it big over here, man. Play by play for most of the six or games this season. I won't be live for, what game is that? Game three or game two or whatever game is the draft day. I won't be live for that game, but I will be live for the rest of the games. Brian got, get a, I hope he gets another one. He need to come to Philly for that though. Let's go. Uh, Josh Hart with the ball. Bounce pass. He missed, he messes up. Oh, come on. Stop fouling my bull Joel and B, bruh. Because cause I look at it like this. They turned the ball over. I look at it like this. If you can't guard them, you got to foul them. You know what I'm saying? If you can't guard them, you got to foul them. You know what I'm saying? They, they, just, they just don't know what to do, man. They don't know what to do, right? They feeling the pressure right now. 
Let's go. Gets the screen by Joel Embiid. Tyrese Massey with the ball. He starts to drill. Gets it to Joel Embiid. Joel Embiid shoots the three. And he makes it, baby! Ties the game at 69. The reigning MVP. Hit the, put the threes in the chat, bro. 7 old run, baby. Put the threes in the freaking chat. Let's go. Jalen Brunson gets it to Dante DiVincenzo. He shoots the three. Oh, snap. He makes it. Nah, bro. Nah, bro. Nah. 72 to 69. Let's go, baby. Let's go. Four minutes and 49 seconds left in the third quarter. Tyrese Massey with the ball. Let's go. Let's go. Let's go. He gets the, oh, he's observing the court. Gets the screen by Joel Embiid. He's looking around. Gets it to Joel Embiid. Joel Embiid. Oh, he's about to cook. He's about to cook hard to start. He's about to cook hard to start. He's backing him down. He's backing him down. The double team doesn't come. Cook him, Joel. He gives a nice pass to Kelly, and he gets the layup. Let's go. Great assist by Joel Embiid. It is a one-point game. 71 to 72. Four minutes and 22 seconds left in the third quarter. Jalen Brunson. Has the ball being guarded by Tyrese Max. He gets a screen by Hart to start. Passes to Dante DiVincenzo. He gives it to Josh Hart. Josh Hart driving. He, he thinks twice when he sees that bull. Joel B stops his dribble. Gives it to OG Anobi. OG Anobi is driving to the lane. And he looks like he's going to put up a little midi. Misses it badly. Rebound by the Philadelphia 76ers. 71 and 72. Four minutes left in the third quarter. Tyrese Max. He's driving past Hart to start. Oh, man. Where is the foul? He caught, finally caught a foul. And Tyrese Max. He will be going to the line for two, baby. Let's go. Let's go. Shout out to the people in the back. Shout out to all the people that's doubting. We need all y'all. You know what I'm saying? Nobody wants smoke with Denver Nuggets. Brown getting, uh, Fakers beat the Nuggets. Yeah. I don't, I'm not, I think that is cap. Y'all just want them to win. They're not winning that series, bro. <laughs> like, the Lakers aren't being in the Nuggets in the first round. It's not happening. It might be a good series. Is not happening. Even if it goes to game seven, it's not happening. I don't see it. I I would be happy for them though. If they if the Lakers did win, I would be happy because I, I I'm a big LeBron guy. You know what I mean? I'm a big LeBron guy. You know what I mean? But uh the game is tied 72 to 72, three minutes and fifty three minutes and fifty seven seconds left in the third quarter. Sixers tied the game up. Shout out to everybody in the building. If you haven't already hit the like button, hit the like button, consider subscribing to your bull. It's a one-point game. Three minutes and 50 seconds left in the third quarter. Jalen Brunson with the ball. Gives it to Josh Hart. Josh Hart gives it to Dante DiVincenzo. He turns the ball over. Good steal by Joel Embiid. Bounce past the Kelly over there. He dunks the ball. Let's freaking go. Mike Sports Vibes. Thank you for vibing with me. The MVP, MVP, the MVP. 75 to 72. Three minutes and 26 seconds left in the third quarter. Dante DiVincenzo with the ball. Being guarded by Kelly Oubre Jr. What's he going to do when we come for you? Let's go, Jr. Then because of the Josh Hart, a wide open three. And he misses it. Rebound by Kyle Lowry. Let's go, Sixers, baby. Let's go. Oh, man. Joe B fakes the three. Gives it to Kyle Lowry. He fakes the three also. He gives it to Kelly Oubre Jr. He shoots the three. And he makes it. Put the threes in the chat, baby. 78 to 72. Two minutes and 57 seconds left in the third quarter. Jalen Brunson with the ball. Gives it to OG Nobi. OG Nobi gives it to Josh Hart. And then Joel B goes hard. The oh, man. There's a foul on Josh Hart. So he will be going to the line for two. But good defense by Joel B. Not to just give him an easy bucket. Let's go. Do you see the pass? The bounce pass. The Kelly Oubre Jr. By the reigning MVP. Joel MVP. Let's go. You already know the vibes, man. Stop Mike playing. Sports vibes. Thank you for they playing vibes games with, with me, me right now, bro. They playing get any Mr. Free Throw. And he missed the first free throw. Let's freaking go, bro. I told you the fourth quarter would be a blowout. Y'all think I'm playing? Watch. 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 For everybody that's doubting, watch. Let's go. Y'all thought I was joking. Y'all thought I was joking. Watch. You thought I'm capping right now. You think I'm capping? Watch. We're going to win by 10, 15 points in the fourth quarter. I'm trying to tell y'all. Trying to tell y'all. Watch. I said the comeback's going to happen in the third, and it did. Let's go. Think I'm playing. Watch. They don't have enough. Y'all think I'm playing. All right, let's go. Tyrese Massey with the ball. Let's go. Tyrese, give, oh, he gets a screen by Joel Embiid. 
He's going to pass it to Joel Embiid. Almost a turnover. Really regains control of the ball. Joel Embiid asking to give it to... Uh, he gives it to Kelly Oubre Jr. Six on the shot clock. Gives it right back to Joel Embiid. There will be a turnover. Get in front of him, Kyle Lowry. Get in front of him. Oh, good defense by Kyle Lowry to recover. But he puts it back up and gets the bucket. It is 75 to 78. Three-point game. Two minutes and 21 seconds left in the third quarter. Tyrese Maxey with the ball. And there will be a timeout. Good comeback. Good run. By the Philadelphia 76ers. So that's like a nine to four run right there. Great job by the fight in Philadelphia 76ers. I used to say the fight in Phils, but I'm gonna say the fight in Philadelphia 76ers. They're doing their thing. By the way, talking about the Phillies, the Phillies been doing a thing lately. The Phillies are second in the East, and they're doing a dang on thing, man. Like it's not how you start the season, it's how you finish the season. They're doing absolutely amazing. Their pitching has been wonderful. Their hitting's been excellent. Alec Boom been doing his thing. Um, yeah, man. Bryce Harper's doing his thing. JT's doing his thing. Everybody's doing their thing. Like they're doing excellent, man. Um, they're doing their thing, man. They're they're taking care of business. Uh, let me see what the chat is talking about. What's the chat talking about? All right, let's see. Actually, I think whoever comes out will win in the chip. Hold on, hold up. I'm not sure which. Talk that talk. All right. Talk that talk. Anthony Edwards is a monster. That's a fact. Do you got Heat or Boston? I got Boston, but I wouldn't be surprised that he, I hope the Heat win, though. I'm not going to lie. That crowd, that crowd quiet on the guard. Yeah. Anthony um, Edwards was cooking some. Yeah, Anthony, Ant is something special, bro. Talk that talk, Evan said. Talk, talk, talk. that talk. Shout out to everybody talk. rocking with your bull. It's definitely going down. The game about to go right about to start. Yeah. People want to hate, man. People want to hate. It is what it is, though. It is what it is. Let's go. Tyrese Master with the ball. Gives it to Kyle Lowry. Kyle Lowry shoots the three. Misses it. Rebound by Robinson. Robinson gives it to Josh Hart. Josh Hart with the ball. Two minutes and four seconds left in the third quarter. Josh Hart, what you gonna do when we come for you? Let's go. Robinson with the ball being guarded by Joel Embiid. He gets it to Jalen Brunson. Jalen Brunson being guarded by Joel Embiid and Tyrese. He puts up a little shot. He gets blocked from behind by Tyrese Maxey. That's his second block in the game, I believe, on Jalen Brunson. He shoots the three. He misses it. Rebound by Robinson. Robinson gives it to Josh Hart. Josh Hart's looking downfield. He's trying to drive. He's going to drive on Joel Embiid. No, he doesn't. He thinks twice. Gives it to McBride. McBride being guarded by Kelly Oubre Jr. One minute and 34 seconds left in the third quarter. Let's go. Bodanovich is shooting over Tyrese Maxey. He gets the roll and it goes in. It is a one-point game, 78 to 77. One minute and 21 seconds left in the third quarter. Joel Embiid with the ball. Oh, gives it to Tyrese. Almost threw it away, but they regain control. Gets a screen by Joel Embiid. Looking around. Go ahead, Joel. Go ahead, Tyrese. Take him off. Take him off the dribble, baby. Take him off the dribble. He can't guard you. He can't guard you. Let's go. He does, and he gets the layup. 80 to 77. One minute and three seconds left in the third quarter. Tyrese Maxley is simply amazing, man. 80 to 77. Three-point game. 58 seconds left in the third quarter. McBride, 10 points for Tyrese Maxey alone. He has 22 points in the game. Let's go. McBride with the ball, driving to the lane, driving to the lane. Gives it to Josh Hart. Josh Hart fakes the three, gives it to Bodanovich. Bodanovich, oh, he almost gets the ball stripped. He puts up a little midi midi over top of Kelly Uber Jr. But Joel Embiid gets the rebound. He misses it. Let's go. Joel Embiid with the ball. Point Joel Embiid with the ball. And then he shoots the three, but he gets blocked. Come on. Dang. Josh Hart with the ball, going hard in the paint. Oh, he does get it over Joel Embiid. What a bucket by Josh Hart over Joel Embiid's arm, over his over his uh, hand. 20 seconds left in the third quarter. The Sixers and the New York Knicks are battling. Fourth quarter beatdown is coming very soon. Let's go. Tyrese Maxey with the ball. He's driving to the lane, driving to the lane, driving to the lane. You will not stop that. That is too easy. You guys cannot stop that, man. It's 82 to 79, six seconds left. Jalen Brunson. Oh, get at it. Oh, draw the beat tripped over Jalen Brunson. Jalen Brunson fell on the ground. J Kyle Lowry is raising his hand that he fouled Jalen Brunson. I'm trying to figure out something here. But I want to say, yeah, Tyrese Massey's been doing excellent on the defensive side of the ball, man. He's blocking Jalen Brunson from behind. Uh, every time he goes up for a shot, he might beat him off the dribble a little bit, but he recovers by blocking him. 
And I love it, man. Tyrese Maxey is just doing a lot of good things, man. 82 to 79. I'm not sure Jalen Brunson's at the free throw line, but are the Sixers in the penalty? No, they're not. So it's two seconds. Bodanovic puts up a shot, misses it, and the Sixers will be up. They will be up by three going into the fourth quarter. 82 to 79. Blowout time. It's a blowout time. It's a blowout time. Yes, it is. It's a blowout time. Let's go, Sixers, man. You're a little vibes, man. Let's go, man. It's time to party, man. One more time for your boy. Just one more time. I promise you, one more time, one more time. All right, y'all already know the vibes, man. Let's go, let's go, Mike let's go, let's go, vibes. let's go. Thank fourth you quarter, for baby, vibing fourth with quarter, me. baby, and the Sixers are up. Let's freaking go. Now, it's time to get your lemon pepper wings ready. Now, it's time to get your popcorn ready. It's about to go down. It's time to dance. It's time to party. You already know the vibes. Let's go. That man is about to go down, bruh. What game is after this, y'all? Is there another game after this? Don't really matter. We just talking about the Sixers, but you already know the vibes. Shout out to Chris for real. Yeah, 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 yeah. Shout out to my people when they're back. Shout out to my people when they're right. Shout out to the people when they're back. The cameraman got hurt. Oh, dang, that's crazy. That's crazy. Mo, yo, Ingram, what's up with it, bruh? What's up with it, Ingram? What's good with y'all? Which y'all who play after this? Who play after this? I know that the uh the Timberwolves beat the um, which I'm gonna call it, the Suns. Is there another game or is it all the games tomorrow or the rest of the games tomorrow? I don't know why I feel like there's another game supposed to come on after this. Uh, maybe I'm wrong. Maybe I'm wrong. But shout out to everybody in the building. You already know the vibes, man. We're doing it big right now, man. We definitely doing it big. We having fun. We we it's lit over here. And uh, if you haven't already, hit that like button, hit that like button. Consider subscribing to your boy. You already know the vibes, man. Play by play for most of the six or games of the season. We having fun. We 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 enjoying each other's company. Even though I be disagreeing with a lot of people, what they be saying, they be disagreeing. They be disagreeing with what I be saying a lot of time. It's all love at the end of the day. Everybody's entitled to their own opinion. Um, it is what it is. <laughs> that's how that's how it is, man. Mike Sports vibes. We we vibing. That's the whole point of this channel is to vibe out and enjoy each other. Like is each other's company. You feel me? Oh, uh, Lakers play after this. You already know. Uh, I don't already know. That's why I'm asking, bro. <laughs> I don't know. I ain't worried about none of them Lakers, bro. <laughs> it's like, no, but um, LeBron James, man, I'm, I like LeBron, man. I'm cheering for him. I wouldn't mind seeing LeBron. Make, yo, if he could get out of the, beat the Nuggets, bro, that would be crazy. That would be crazy GOAT discussion because the Nuggets is, ain't no, the Nuggets ain't no joke. If they could somehow get past the Nuggets, which I doubt, bro, like that's a good, that's a good conversation to have. Like, that's a good behind team. Beat the defending champions like that. Yeah, that's a good, that's a good uh, that's a good uh a good team right there. All right, fourth quarter is in session. Let's go, Sixers. Can the Sixers beat the New York Knicks? I'm already calling it, bro. Jalen Brunson with the ball. He's driving to the lane, puts up a, nope, he gives it to Bodanovich. Bodanovich. Going hard in the paint, off the backboard, misses it. Rebound by Paul Reed. He gives it to Buddy Hill. Buddy Hill gives it to Tyrese Maxey. Tyrese Maxey with the ball. Let's go. Let's go. Let's ball out, baby. Let's ball out, baby. He's looking around, observing the court. Gets the screen by Nicholas Batoon. He's driving. Oh, he turns the ball over to, to Bodanovich. Bodanovich going hard in the paint. Gets blocked by behind by Nicholas Batoon. Jalen Brunson gives the ball to, to Josh Hart. And then he gets, oh my goodness, rebound by Tobias Harris. Nicholas Batum saved a bucket right there. Nicholas Batum, that block was awesome, my guy. Shout out to my guy, Nicholas Batum. Tyler's Massey with the ball, driving to the lane. Driving. Oh, Jalen Brunson puts it up, gets blocked. Rebound by Bodanovich, gives it to Jalen Brunson. Jalen Brunson with the ball, being guarded by Nicholas Batum. He gives it to Bodanovich for a wide open three, and he makes it. 
The game is tied up 82 to 82. All right, it's go time. It's go time. It's go time. Let's go. Tyrese Massey with the ball. He's, oh, he's moving around. Being guarded by Bodani. There's only one way to make the impossible oh possible. Yeah, let's go. Tyrese Massey with the ball. He's being guarded by McBride. He's driving to the lane. Gives it to a wide open. Paul Reed gets blocked. 2.6 seconds left. That is not the, come on. Really? You kick it out to Paul Reed for a quarter. Three. I'm not saying Paul Reed can't make the dang old shot, but. No, 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 no. That's not the best shot we can get. That's not the best shot we can get right there. All right, let's go. Tyrese Massey with the ball. Oh, he turns the ball over. All right, 10 minutes to 25 seconds of the fourth quarter. Let's go. Jalen Brunson with the ball. Let's go. Big guard about, oh, he gives it to Bodanovich. Bodanovich gives it right back to Jalen Brunson. We need, we need Joel Embiid back in the game now. Now. Put him in the game now. Jalen Brunson with the ball. He drives it to the lane. Drives it to the lane on Tyrese Massey. Puts it up. Misses it. Get the read. Oh, my gosh. They can never box out and get this dang on defensive rebound. Come on. Come on. Let's go. Tyrese Massey with the ball. He gives it to Tobias. Tobias, drive it to the lane. Drive it to the lane. Gives it to Nicholas Batum for corner three. Misses it. Rebound by Jalen Brunson. Jalen Brunson with the ball. Let's go. Defense, y'all. Defense. Let's go. 84-82. Knicks are up. Let's go. Josh Hart. Passes it to Jalen Brunson, almost turns the ball over, but he regains control, being guarded by Buddy Hill, driving on Buddy Hill. Oh, he does a midi, midi fadeaway, misses it. Get the rebound. Rebound by Nicholas Batuni, gives it to Paul Reed. Paul Reed in the mud with the ball. He's driving. He's driving on Bodanovich. He gives it to Nicholas Batuni for a corner for a three. Dang, he misses it. Wide open three. We need those. We need those. Wide open. Can't make it. Gosh, Lee. Jalen Brunson with the ball. Get Joel and B back in the dang old game, please. Let's go, Jalen Brunson with the ball. What you gonna do with it, bro? What you gonna do with it, bro? He's being guarded by Tyrese, puts up a shot, misses it. Get the rebound. Good job, Tobias Harris on the rebounding, man. Tobias got like 10 rebounds, I think. Let's go. Toby with the ball. Being guarded by, oh, Josh. Oh, he crosses him up, puts up a shot, makes it. Tobias Harris. The game is tied 84 to 84. Let's go, baby. Joel Embiid is about to check right back in the game. Oh, man. McBride with the ball. Being guarded by Buddy Hill. He gives it to Josh Hart. Josh Hart gives it to Bodanovich. Bodanovich with the ball. Gives it back to, to McBride. McBride looking around. Being guarded by Buddy Hill. He's trying to cross up Buddy Hill. driving right past him. He's driving right past him. Oh, he puts up the shot off the backboard and makes it. Mm, that was nasty. Let's go. Tyrese Maxey with the ball. I think they're going to challenge that play. Oh, my gosh. On the inbounds, y'all got to pay attention, bro. On the inbounds, you got to pay attention. Hopefully, they lose this challenge. I got to look at the replay, my dang old self. But, um, yeah, 84-86. 84-86, 8 minutes and 21 seconds. Let's go Sixers, man. We're going to win this game. We're going to win this game, y'all. Yeah, it's still close. Lakers play at 8.30. Okay. We need more Tobias. Oh, man. Come on, Paul Reed. What the? Yeah, yeah bruh. And B can't sit long. He got to come back. Big move, Tobias. Yeah. All right, y'all. It's crunch time. We eight minutes. We're not halfway through the quarter. It's getting there. It's getting crunch time. Well, it really is crunch time. It's fourth quarter. But uh, you know what I mean, like real crunch time a little bit later. But um, yeah, we need uh, my boy Too Evil. <laughs> um, but shout out to everybody in the building, Chris for real, Malik. Actually, I think whoever comes, yeah. All right, y'all. All right, Ty's in the oh crap, Ty in the building. He said fakers. It went off Tyree's leg. Oh, man. All right. All right, we're going to see what happens. We, go, we just got to play good defense. It is what it is. Let's go. Joel and B will be back. 
Let's go. Let's dominate. Let's dominate. Let's dominate. It's fourth quarter. It's crunch time. It's crunch time. He said, and you know that. All right, we want to see. I don't know. I I don't know. I didn't see the play. I mean, I didn't I didn't notice how it happened exactly. So I gotta I gotta see. I gotta see. I don't know. So I'm not gonna speak on it until I see. But uh We shall see. Let's go sixes. I love it. I love it. Mike Sports Vibes. Thank you for vibing with me. You already know the vibes, man. Let's get it. Let's see if they win this challenge. Turning point of the game. We're going to see what happens, man. Yo. This is a good behind game. As long as we win it, I'm cool. Yeah, it went off his leg. All right, let's go. Inbound the ball to Josh Hart. Gives it to Bodanovich. Bodanovich gives it right back to uh, McBride. McBride with the ball. He's driving. He gives it to a wide open Josh Hart for three, and he misses it. But they get the offensive rebound. Bodanovich shoots a wide open three, and he misses it. Get the freaking rebounds. Josh Hart. Gosh, Josh Charles go to the free throw line for two. These points won't happen if we rebound the ball. You know what I mean? These points won't happen if we will rebound the ball. You get the second chance points won't happen. But when we give up, like Joel Embiid had the ball and he lost it to uh, Robinson. He just let him take the ball from him. Like we got to get our rebounds. This stuff, that wouldn't even be happening. We have to rebound. Come on. Kyle Lowry with the ball. He gives it to Joel Embiid. Joel Embiid gives it to Tobias Harris. Tobias is driving to the lane. Easy layup for Tobias Harris. Good job, Toby, Toby, Toby. Oh, let's go. 86 to 88. Two-point game. Knicks are up. McBride shoots a wide open three, and he makes it. Oh, my gosh. Five-point game. 91 to 86. Come on. Seven minutes and 30 seconds left. Joel Embiid with the ball. Come on. It's crunch time. Let's go. Give it to Toby. Toby's looking around. Shoots a three. Make that. Please make that. Oh, my gosh. Rebound by Kyle Lowry. Gives it to Joel Embiid. Joel Embiid gives it to Buddy Hill for a wide open three. Oh, my gosh. Buddy Hill, you got to make that, man. You have to make it. Come on. McBride with the ball. Oh, my gosh, bro. McBride. Oh, good defense by Kyle Lowry. Oh, good steal. Let's go. We got to get a bucket here. We got to get a bucket here. Six minutes, 53 points. I mean, 53 seconds. Let's go. Joel Embiid with the ball. He, oh, he doesn't shoot the midi. He gives it to Kyle Lowry. Kyle Lowry is getting a screen by Joel Embiid. He uses the screen. Oh, Joel Embiid. He get, oh, is Joel Embiid going to shoot the three? He does shoot the three. Misses it short. Oh, my gosh. I. Oh. All right, let's go. McBride with the ball. He being guard. Oh, he gets a scream by uh, Robinson. Robinson, Josh Hart. Josh Hart gives it to Bodanovich. Bodanovich being guarded by Kyle Lowry. Oh, good defense by. Oh, 
That's a half court. It's not a half court violation. Oh man, back court violation. Oh, Josh Hart shoots the three, misses it. Rebound. Thank you. Oh my gosh, bro. All right. Six minutes and 14 seconds left. Knicks are up by five. Timeout. Is it a timeout? No, it's not a timeout. We got to, we have to rebound. We have to rebound. We have to rebound. Bench points. We only got seven bench points, bro. To, to the Knicks. The Knicks got 38. Get the freak out of here, bro. Really? Our bench can only get us seven points? Wow. Let's go. Tyrese Maxey with the ball. Gives it to Tobias. Tobias Harris. It's a screen by Joel. Joel B. Oh, oh, he's going to look for Joel B. Gives it to Joel B. Joel B with six on the shot clock. Come on, Joel. You got to work. You got to work, Joel. Oh, my gosh. Oh, it's a foul. Woo. Luckily, that's a foul. It's a free throw shot. Oh, my gosh, bro. I would have been like, yo, another turnover, bro. Another turnover, bro. Let's go. Did he make these? Let me see. Oh, it's a foul on uh, McBride. He hit his hand. Look at the reach in. Hit his hand. Yup, that's a foul. That's a foul. All right, let's go. Choose the first free throw, makes it. All right, so uh, four-point game. Let's make it a three-point game. We got this, y'all. We're going to win this game. Five minutes and 53 seconds left in the fourth quarter. Woo, it's going down to the wire. I thought it was going to be a blowout. Not a blowout in the fourth. <laughs> All right, three-point game. Let's go, baby. Come on, Sixers. Let's go. Let's go, baby. Come on. Get hype in the chat, man. All the Sixers fans in the building, man. Let's go. Let's go. Taylor Brunson with the ball. Being guarded by Kelly Oubre Jr. Five minutes and 49 seconds left in the fourth quarter. Taylor Brunson passes it to Josh Hart. Josh Hart looking around, observing the court. Gives it back to Jalen Brunson. Jalen Brunson being guarded by Kelly Oubre Jr. Gets a screen by Robinson. Oh, it's still by Kelly Oubre Jr. Let's go. Oh, he gives it to Tyrese Max and he makes the layup. What? Freaking go! One point game, 90 to 91. Let's freaking go, baby. 91 to 90. Knicks got the lead. McBride with the ball. Being guarded by Kelly Oubre Jr. Oh, almost another steal. Oh, it's a backcourt. It's not a backcourt. It's not a backcourt. Ah! Let's go, Josh Hart with the ball. Let's go. Going between the legs. Shoots the three. Please miss it. Oh, he makes it. Oh, my gosh. Wow. Four point game. Wow. That is a big, big, Time shot by Josh Hart to make that three to make it a four point game. All right, let's go. Tyrese Maxey with the ball. Come on, let's go. Let's go. We got enough time. Let's go. Here's a screen by Joel Embiid. He's going to give it to Joel Embiid. Joel Embiid's going to hit, shoot the shot, miss it, but he's going to go. He's going to go to the free throw line for two. Stop the clock, and he's going to go to the free throw line for two. Let's go. Let's go. Shout out to everybody rocking with your boy. If you haven't already, hit that like button. Hit that like button. Hit that like button. Because so consider subscribing to your boy. Play by play for most of the Philadelphia 76ers games this season. It's definitely going down this playoff run. I'll be live for most of the games. The only game I will be missing will be the draft day. Because I am a hybrid sports fan. Philly everything besides football. Football, I am a Viking fan. I am a hybrid sports fan. Let's go. You already know the vibes. But um, other than that, I will be live for most of the other games. And um, unless some family stuff happens, <clears throat> family comes first. But yeah, shout out to everybody in the building. Uh, thanks for rocking with me. It's definitely going down. What an amazing game. This game is going back and forth. This is a type of playoff game that I love. This is the type of playoff game that motivates. Like, I love doing this type of stuff, man. I love it, man. Let's go. Jordan B makes the second free throw. It is 94 to 92. Four minutes and 47 seconds left in the fourth quarter. Let's go. McBride with the ball. Let's go. McBride is. With the ball, let's go. He's being guarded by Kelly Oubre Jr. Let's go. Let's get another steal. Gives it to OG Anobi. OG Anobi gives it to Josh Hart. Josh Hart gives it to McBride. McBride fakes the three. He's driving. He's driving. Puts up a shot. Misses it. Get the rebound. Get the freaking rebound. Oh my gosh, bro. They're allowing the Knicks to get every single offensive rebound. They don't box out at all, bro. What are they doing, bro? Oh my gosh, bro. To Joel Embiid with the ball. Got Robinson on him. Shoots a midi over top of him. Misses it. It's short. Come on. All right, it's still going to be Sixer ball. Like, come on, bro. Like, like, I just don't understand it, bro. Why are we giving up so many offensive rebounds? 
Like, bro, they probably got like 20 offensive rebounds this game, bro. Like, I didn't look at it since halftime. Halftime, they had 11. Bro, they probably got 20 offensive rebounds, bro. It is not like there's no Sixers in the paint. They're not boxing out, bro. They're not boxing out. Some of these points are because we're letting them get the freaking offensive rebound. It's just putbacks. That's all it is. Most of it. We have to rebound the ball. We would be winning right now if we were if we could freaking rebound the ball on the defense side of the ball. On the defensive side of the ball, we bro, if we were rebound, we'll be winning this this game. I'm I'm trying to tell you, bro. I'm trying to tell you, bro. Talk that talk, yeah, bro. Like I, I'm keeping it real. I'm keeping it one thousand. I'm keeping it real. I love my, I love the Sixers, but bro, they they're not the best rebounding team, bro. They're not. They're not keeping it real. We got to get it together on the boards. This is crunch time. Rebound the ball. Rebound the ball. Thursday Sixers need to upgrade that bench. Sixers, New York Knicks are number one offensive rebounding team. Yeah, 20 offensive rebounds. Bro, I, I, I'm, bro I'd be, I'm, not, I'm not a genius. I'm not the smartest man in the world. I am not like... I, I I know, but I know a little bit about basketball. I don't know everything, but I know I'm watching this game. And every time the Knicks miss a shot, they get a freaking offensive rebound, bro. Every time almost, bro. It's rare when we do get the defensive rebound. That's how bad it is right now. When you're allowing a team to have 20 offensive rebounds, we still got four minutes left in this game. Now, we have to get that together or we're going to lose this game. I'm keeping it real. And as much as I'm a diehard Sixers fan, I love my Sixers with all my heart. But I know that rebounding is such a key factor in winning. And if you don't rebound defensively, forget the offensive rebounds for us. I'm talking about us getting a defensive rebounds because you're giving the other team more possessions to score. And you know what the Knicks are doing? And that's exactly what they're doing. That's exactly what they're doing. That re offensive rebound by Robinson, that putback should have never happened. That one offensive rebound, they had a couple possessions ago, and Josh Hart got fouled, went to the free throw line, and got another two free throws. Should have never happened, but it did. Why? Because we're not boxing out. Box out and get the defensive rebounds. Can I talk that talk? Talk that talk. Shout out to Skull State of Mind, my guy. How you doing, my guy? Shout out to my guy in the building. You already know the vibes. Let's go. Tears for my guy in the building. Malik Savage, uh, New York Knicks take care of their home court. They're going to win the series. Hopefully they're not. They, hopefully they don't. We got to win this game. This is the game we can honestly win this game. Like there's, We have enough time, bro, to win this game. We just have to rebound the dang on ball. And we got this game. Because I'm telling you, they're only beating us because of these offense. Bro, 20 offensive rebounds is unacceptable. I'm keeping it real. We got to do better. We can win this game, but we have to get the defensive rebounds. That's my predictor. And whoever... Oh, that's what you're predicting? Okay. All right, we got the ball. Niggas with tune with the ball. Let's go. Gives it to Tyrese. Tyrese looking to, looking to give it to, Ty, to Joel and B. Joel and B with the ball. Let's go, Joel. Work him. Six, five, four, three. Come on. Take him. Take it to him, Joel. Three, two, one. He shoots the midi and he airballs it. Come on. Josh Hart with the ball. Gives it to uh, Jalen Brunson. Three minutes and 37 seconds left in the fourth quarter. He's driving down the lane. He shoots a midi. Makes it. Oh, my gosh, bro. Oh. All right. Six-point game. Still enough time, but it's like, gosh, Lee, bro. These shots are. I'm not liking the shots right now. All right, let's go. And Joella Beach is short right now. He's short. He don't got nothing on his shot. Let's go. I don't know if he's tired. I don't know. Give it to Tyrese. Oh, does it give it to Tyrese? Looking for Tyrese. Tyrese, I mean, Joel Embiid shoots the three, misses it. Oh, my gosh, bro. Oh, Jalen Brunson with the ball. 
Stops his dribble. Two minutes and 56 seconds left in the fourth quarter. Jalen Brunson posting up Tyrese. Puts up a midi. Misses it. Gets his own offensive rebound. Gets his own rebound. Oh, my gosh, bro. You can't make this up. He shot the ball and gets his own rebound. He gets his own – he gets an offensive rebound. He shot a midi and then and, and ran to the paint and got his own rebound, bro. Look at this. He shoots it, misses it. He goes right to him. Bro, I don't know what the heck just happened. That's just weird. Let's go. Kyle Lowry with the ball. He gives it to Nicholas Batum. He gives it to Joel Embiid. Joel Embiid, you got to take him fast. Do not take your time, bro. Go. 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 Hook shot. Misses it. Gets his own rebound. Ah, oh, it's going to be a jump ball. I don't know, bro. All right. They still got time, but they only got a little. They, they No more errors. Like two minutes and 28 seconds, you cannot have any more errors. You have to ball out right now. It is what it is. Let's go. Don't ball, Robinson and Joel Embiid. All right, Joel Embiid won the tip. All right, let's go. Screen by Joel Embiid. Joel Embiid, Tyrese Maxey. Shoots a three. Looks like y'all blocked, but he made it. Yo, oh my gosh. Three-point game, y'all. Oh, my gosh. Tyrese Maxey makes it, bro. 95 to 98. Oh, my gosh, bro. This game's going down to the wire. Jalen Brunson with the ball. Come on. Can we get a steal right here? Can we get a steal? Let's go. Two minutes and four seconds left in the game. Josh Hart with the ball. He gives it to Jalen Brunson. Jalen Brunson with the ball. What's he going? Go behind his legs. He gets it to Josh Hart for a three. Makes it. Oh, my goodness. Wow. This is crazy. All right, 101 to 95. Let's go. Tyrese Massey with the ball. Gets it to Joel B. Joel B with the ball. He's driving on Robinson. Going hard in the paint. Gets fouled. Going to the free throw line for two. Oh, man. This is crazy. So how much more time we got? No, this it's a it's a time thing now. We gotta see how much time we got. Let me see. All right, one hundred one to ninety five. All right, let's go. All right. 97 to 101. All right, let's go. Let's go. Jalen Brunson with the ball. Being guarded by Kelly Oubre Jr., going between his legs, being guarded by Tobias. He gives it to a wide open OG Anobi, and he, oh my gosh, he makes the three. Oh, damn. Dang, this might be over. Uh, 104 to 97, 104 to 97, one minute and 28 seconds left in the fourth. Wow. Yeah, and they're just making their threes now. Now it's like, ah. Uh, they're all hitting their threes in committee. But there's no, I'm sticking to what I'm saying, bro. I still don't feel like they got enough to beat us in a seven-game series. I feel like we can still win in six games 
if they win this game. They still it still might not happen. I don't know. But they they got a good uh good lead on us right now, up by seven. So even two threes won't tie the game up. And then they're gonna wind some time down. So that's gonna it's gonna be hard. But we have to, we have to do better rebounding. We have to. <laughs> yeah, man. Some back to back threes. Josh Hart hit a three. Ojinobi hit a three. Clutch. Clutch. Mm. At the end, we just didn't do what we needed to do. Uh, Drell and Bead. Well, we got some time. Let's see if we can make a comeback. Oh, let's go. All right. So, a four point game. We hit a three. Put the threes in the chat, baby. Kyle Lowry hit a three, one minute and 23 seconds left in the fourth. Let's go. Play good defense. It's still not over. We just got to play good defense. Good defense. Let's go. Kyle Lowry with 18 points. Four, seven from three. All right. Let's go. Get a steal. Get a steal right here. Get a steal right here. Get a steal right here. Come on. Defense. Defense. Come on. Josh Hart with the ball. Play defense. Oh, Josh Hart with the ball. Shoots another three. He makes it again. Oh, my God. What? Oh, my gosh, bro. Get out of here, bro. Dang. Tyrese Massey gets the, gets the layup. You're going to have to foul. You have to start fouling. You can't even wind time down. You got to start fouling now. Like, you can't even want, let them wind the time down. Like, why are y'all not fouling? Foul. And, you know, Josh Hart was struggling from three all year. Last year, he shot 51% from three. This year, he shot 31%. Below average three-point shooter this year. Let's go. All right, so that's going to be a foul. He pushed bull down, like... <laughs> Oh, man. He didn't really, he didn't really push him. You know, Jalen Brunson's overreacting right there. That wasn't no, that wasn't like a push. Like, he kind of like, he kind of uh, flopped a little bit there. He kind of flopped right there. That, bro, that wasn't nothing crazy. They're not dominating, bro. They're only up by five points. I mean, you're entitled to your own opinion, bro. They're only up by five. How is that dominating? Up by six. He's making his free throw. But what? He had to foul him. If he didn't foul him, then they would uh, wind the clock down. But they're already down by they're down by six two threes now. He made both his free throws. It's a wrap. It's a wrap. We gotta get them next game. Get into the office. Can't harsh your vibe. Not even with man spreading on the. All right, Tyrese Maxey driving to the lane. Easy layup. Five point game. You got a foul right here. Foul right here. Foul. 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 What are y'all doing? Y'all not fouling. I got a fat. Oh, it's over. They letting them wind the time down. It's over. OJ Nobi shoots the midi, misses it. Rebound. Oh my gosh. They get another offensive rebound. It's over. Like this. Oh my gosh, bro. All right. So the Philadelphia 76ers lost. One on, oh, no, it's still 2.7 seconds, but there's a foul, I think. Wow. Yeah. 
he didn't push him though. Like it wasn't like a crazy push. Like if you look at the replay, bro, it was he flopped. He flopped. Jalen Brunson flopped. All right, so one ten to one oh four. All right, so the game will be 111 to 104 to Knicks one. Good win. Good win. Good win for the Knicks. But I'm going to tell you this right now. I still don't think the Knicks is that good. I don't care. I don't care what nobody says. I know we lost. I understand. I understand. You're probably like, well, how are we? If, we, if they ain't that good, then how you lose? All right, well, yeah, we didn't play good. I'm going to tell you why. I'm going to tell you why in a minute. Let me look at the offensive rebounds real quick. I got to look at this. I, I really need to figure this out. This is why we lost, is offensive rebounds. I got to look it up. I'm going to look it up right now. Y'all can look it up if y'all see it in the chat. If you know it, let me know because I'm curious. I am curious about this because I know ain't no freaking way you can win a game giving up that many offensive All right, now look, 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 y'all. 23. Look at this. 20. Oh, hold on. You know what? I'm gonna put the dang on thing on the dang on screen. Hold on, y'all. Hold on. I'm gonna put this on the dang on screen. Ain't no way. Let's see if it shows it. All right. Stats, right? Y'all see it, right? Let me make sure y'all see it real quick. Ain't no freaking way. This was a rebounding game. That's what that's what made us lose. Every you could say whatever you want. What made us lose is we can't rebound. This that was the biggest crucial thing that got us to lose this game. Rebounding. Like. All right, let me, uh, y'all see that. I'm not sure if y'all see it, but we gave up 23 offensive rebounds, y'all. We gave up 23 offensive rebounds. Yes, and B didn't do his thing hard, hit those clutch threes. OG Cook uh, did a couple of threes, too. But, uh, I still think we could win this game. We need someone else to give us something on the offensive side of the ball. Nobody really did besides Tyrese Maxey and uh and Joel B. Kyle Lowry did did his thing as well. The bench points were absolutely trash this game. You know what I mean? Bench couldn't buy a bucket. Nobody came through. Buddy Hill missing threes wide open. That's the problem with Buddy Hill. Like I I'm I'm sorry about Buddy Hill, but we're going. I just hope he does better. That's all I'm going to say. Tobias in 31 minutes had seven points and nine rebounds. Um, But really, the people that really struggled the most, I mean, of course, Joel Embiid struggled in, in, in the fourth quarter. He airballed a midi. He missed a three. He was just short. He, could, he couldn't get no lift on his shot. He struggled. All right. Um, Tyrese Massey had a, 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 a pretty darn good game. 33 points, four assists, and two rebounds. Joel Embiid was 29.6 assists and 8 rebounds. My problem with Joel Embiid, he has to do better rebounding the ball. Period. Point blank, period. Has to rebound. You know what I mean? Got to rebound. Um, Kelly Oubre Jr. Didn't have the best game offensively at all. Tobias Harris, I'm, I'm not going to say nothing about him. This is what it is. Nicholas Batum, 3 points. Paul Reed, 4 points. Buddy Hill, 0 points. In 11 minutes. And it's not like he had he didn't have a shot. He had wide open. Yes, I got you, bro. I got you, bro. Hold on. Let me get let me set this up. Let me set this up right now. Anybody want to get on the chat? Let me know. Let me know.
Like, I'm just so over this, bro. Like, I don't understand it, bro. Embiid, I don't know what's up with Embiid. Like, that, that last quarter, he definitely felt I, I, I could, his, his shot had no lift. He had a pretty good game overall, though, to be honest with you. It's just in the clutch moment, he didn't have a good game. Would it count the most? But there's so many other factors, man. We just, just couldn't get it together, man. We're giving up these threes. Like, Josh Hart saved the Knicks. He hit, like, three threes at the end. OJ Nobi hit, like, two threes at the end. Um, I'm going to put my boy AJ in the building. AJ. AJ, what's good with you, bro? How you doing? Good. Uh, yeah, I don't like it. And me, I think, why, I, why are we force feeding and read the ball? Like, there needs to be, like, some good flow, man. And Maxi was cooking. Maxi was cooking. Let's not pretend like he's hey, not hold, hold on real quick. Um, so, nah, they, their best player is Jalen Brunson. That's their star player. Dude, they're, they're better missing. without Randall. He's that. way better than I'm not gonna say he's way better, but he's better than Julius Randle. Like I'm just they're better without Randle. They play better without Randle because yeah. Randle sucks in the playoffs. Because Randle was, only took away shots from like so many of the players, and then and then like they wouldn't have won with Randle. But yeah, my favorite. Zozo, what's good, my boy? What's the deal? What up, oh, man? man? Man, we gave up too many offensive rebounds, man. That was the key. Yeah, I ain't know the Knicks was that good. They're not. Well, we locked up. We locked up Brunson. Man. They're not that good. We just can't rebound the damn ball, bro. We gave up AJ. You know how many times we, we gave up twenty three offensive rebounds, bro? Bro, we, bro, we locked up Brunson, bro. That's like how do we lose the game while we locked up Brunson? Because Brunson we couldn't, because we gave up too many offensive rebounds. If we would get the well, defensive rebounds, is, is that, of course, the rebound. But well, how do you leave these guys wide open? Leave them wide open. So this was game was game? so like we. Sh I'm not gonna say we should have. We. I'm not gonna say we should have won because it's, 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 you can't say that if you if you just if you if you don't win. So I'm not gonna say that you lose. We lost. It is what it is. But I would say this: the reason why we lost, the biggest factor. It's not even them making their threes at the end. Because before all that even happened, throughout the whole entire game, they had 11 offensive rebounds in the first half alone, bro. 11 offensive rebounds. They finished with 23 offensive rebounds. That's bad. Yeah. Where's the boxing you can, out? You can't rely on the to get every rebound on one leg. I know. I know that's true. But he had eight. He had eight rebounds. He got at least give us... A couple or more, and then and then uh, on top of a couple more of it, and no one else is helping him get the rebound. That is true. That is true. But they need to box out better. I'm gonna tell you this right now. It was a rebound that Kelly Oubre Jr. Literally, I I remember it, man. It was like OG and Nobi, like literally took it from him like he was a little kid. OG and Nobi snatched the ball from Kelly Oubre Jr. over top of him and just took the ball from him. I'm like, yo, y'all gotta do better than that rebounding is the biggest kryptonite on this team right now i still think we're going to win this game this series in six in my opinion we win the next game we have to win we, the next game we have to win the next game yeah we have to we definitely we almost have just to. stole one but you know what happened during the run we're playing like great defense like you know i think kelly Oubre had five steals yeah, I think but Kelly he has to, had a good game, but he, he had play a, better offensively. Right. And we were scoring, we we're making our three pointers. At the end, you know, we like we were forcing it to MB. We weren't like having a flow on offense or we the ball movement. Maxi, like Maxi was balling. Maxi was balling. And then, you know, Kyle Lowry was also balling. So I don't know why we gave it, kept giving the ball to MB. He can't well, even get to the rim. Well, right the now. thing about it, is, uh, I would say that I would love – I mean, the reason why you're giving it to him because he's the best player on your team at the end. I understand he was struggling at the end, but I feel like Tyrese Maxey has to have that mindset where, look, like when I have the opportunity, I'm going to go get it. But he doesn't, he doesn't have that confidence, I guess, enough to be like, yo, I'm going to take it and I'm, gonna, I'm not going to pass it to Joel Embiid. They were forcing the ball to Joel Embiid, but, I mean, he is the best player. He just didn't – he just wasn't clutch. He wasn't clutch at the end. Hey, 
Man, I ain't know y'all had Kyle Larry. Yeah, Kyle Lowry, yeah. He ain't doing shit over there? Yeah, 18 points. Hey, is that hey, AJ, is that your fan? It's a little loud. I'm not sure. I'm not sure whose fan no, it is. I, it might be my like computer or something. Oh, it's your computer? Okay. All right. But yeah, man. Um, like I said, man, I just this game was lost by it wasn't even really the last like the the, the missed shots by Joel and B at the end. I think it's deeper than that. I think it was be from the very beginning, AJ, it's the rebounding. I know, I know it sounds so boring, but it's so true, bro. When you give up 23 offensive rebounds and they're scoring off of most of those, bro, you're going to lose the game. You're going to. You're going the to lose. The thing is that like, I'm not really confident about Embiid right now because uh, he had to get re-injured. Like, he was he was cooking the Knicks. Like, it, they Only points he had. Joel would be. If, if Joel and B was not injured, I would be okay with him, like, them, like, forcing the ball to Joel and B to make him some play for him. But, like, he was not making anything. He was, like, did he go in the paint? I don't think he went in the paint. He didn't go not, in the not paint. Not much. Not much. He I'll had 29 pushed. points. He had 29 points. He want to get re-injured after getting re-injured again. So, Hey man, listen, Mike. What I've been telling you, bro. I don't know what you've been. <laughs> you know what? No, you know what I've been telling you about your boy, man. He don't show up in the playoffs, man. Man, he all just, I got to say, he just he don't had a, show up. He had a good game besides the fourth quarter. Which man, he really need a, a game like this. He need about thirty-five, dinner, thirty five, dinner, 40 points. He needed to yeah, be but he better. Was injured. Hey, listen, hey, hey, AJ, what Mike tell me the other day when I was in the chat, I said y'all would have lost to the Heat if Jimmy Butler ain't get hurt. Mike told me out of his mouth, injuries is part of the game. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, you told me that just the other day. I still think y'all can beat him, though. I still think y'all can beat him, though. Yo, I'm going I'm to keep it real. Like, I, it really depends on Joel and B. I feel like I feel like no, it depends on the team rebounding. That's that's really what lost us this game. Other than Joel and B missing the last shots in the fourth quarter, what lost us this game? It was the rebounding. What big man y'all got besides him? Uh Paul Reed, but he didn't play good at all. See y'all, you see, so like y'all ain't really got no big man to get them down rebound. Because the Paul Knicks, Reed, the, the Knicks he had a big four team, points. right? Nah, yeah, he, he was cooking. Next week. He was. Yeah, back, like hey, first of, I'm gonna say this. Paul Reed gave us four points. That's that's. I don't know. He gave us five rebounds, which is good. Um, I will say this, man. Hartenstein was getting cooked. That's why Robinson was in the game. Hart, Robinson played better defense on Joel Embiid than Hartenstein because that because in the first half Hartenstein was getting cooked by Joel Embiid. It was and one after and one. It was and then when he got hurt. My issue with Joel Embiid, more than anything in this game, not even the fourth quarter, why did you try to do an M1 one-handed dunk? He threw it off the backboard, caught it with one hand, and dunked it on the ball. Why are you doing all that with a knee that you, that's not 100%? Yeah, why see, no are one, you trying no to one show else wanted to score. No one else wanted to score, and I guess he kind of, like, kind of forced it. <laughs> but remember, why did he do that? Because the Knicks were coming back, and he's just like, I'm going to do it myself. But, but why, you, why, you use, it. why are you using one hand, not two hands? No, no, it, was, it wasn't even that. He landed wrong. He landed he, – all his weight was on one leg, and that's the leg I think that's, that just got sur- that he just got surgery on. So he just fell on the ground after he did the dunk. He I just fell you, on the man. ground. I feel you, but, Mike, I told you this, I told you this a couple months ago, bro. He not like that in the playoffs, bro. You gonna realize that one one day or another, you are gonna say, "Zo, you was right." You gonna so, realize. So, so when we when we win the ne- next game, is everybody gonna have that same energy? I'm yeah. not watching no ESPN for the rest of the night. I'm not watching. <laughs> it. I'm not watching first take. I don't want to hear Stephen A. Smith's mouth. I don't want to hear none of them. So let me. I don't want to hear none of them. So so was the Knicks throwing a big boy at MB? Because I watched ESPN. They said they're going to use their big people on, 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 on your boy. Yeah, they, they did. But my whole thing is he was dominating. He was cooking them. He had 29 points, and he could have had more, but he was just – How many, just point, didn't have a, how many huh? points did he have in the fourth quarter? I don't know. He didn't do good in the fourth. I don't think he had – I don't know what he did in the fourth. The fourth see, was trash. In the, in the fourth the quarter, fourth you see, at the, at the end of the day, man, 
the fourth quarter will really matter. The first and second quarter is cool. The fourth quarter is crunch time. That's where you need to put up your 10 to 15 points in the that's fourth true. quarter. That's definitely true. And that's what he did against the Heat. That's what he did against yeah. the Heat. But let me say this. Let me say this. My whole thing is this. Beyond anything on this team, I know they didn't play good. The Sixers didn't play good when it came down to it at the end. But it's the rebounding the ball. Everybody yeah. that it's the it's the little things in basketball, kind of like in football, the little things. You just can't yeah. throw the interception. You got to throw the ball away. Same thing with basketball. You got to rebound the ball. The big men and the point, the uh point guards, the power forwards, the small forwards, every position has to get your rebound. You got to box out and get your rebound. When you play street ball, one of the most important things when you when you play in street ball is rebounding the damn ball. Because if you let the other opponent get the offensive rebound, they're going to have more possessions to score on you. Yeah. Uh, Buddy Hill and Tobias don't need to be back. Yeah, Malik, I feel you. But I'm going to tell you this right now. We still going to win this series. We just got to win next game. I'm about to get off, though. I'm about to. I, I don't know if I might buy this fight. I might buy this fight and go live. I'm not going to lie. I might buy the Ryan Garcia and Devin Haney fight and go live, bro. I'm thinking about it. Make a don't thumbnail. Garcia, do it. Garcia, about to get his ass beat, man. I'm about, man. I want to see it. I like Ryan Garcia though, but I'm a man, big he's been Devin. Triple lately. I, I'm a big Devin. I've been covering. I've been. I've been uh following Devin before he became like this big name, and and this is when you go far as back as when Devin was being trained by uh, trained by uh Floyd Mayweather Senior. You know, Floyd Mayweather Senior was training Devin at a, some point in his career. Like I'm talking about early in his career. And um, I was following him. Um, I see the potential, and I just want to see him. You know, I mean, because a lot of people's dodging smoke right now in the in in boxing. So if he beats Ryan, which is a high chance he could, he will. But I hope he fights Tank, or I hope he fights uh Tank or uh Shakur Stevenson. But I might buy the fight, man. I'm thinking Me about what time the I'm fight come on. Get my cable cut back on right now. Watch that bit. That bit come on what by eleven o'clock. <laughs> I don't know. I'm about to look. Hey, you need, hey, you need about one of these fire stick from my people, bro. That bitch is true. Oh, AJ, back in the. I'm about to get that joint though, man. I'm about to get. I'm about to watch this dang on fight. I'm not even lying. I'm about to watch this fight. Uh, hold on. Who in the car? Okay, so yo, I'm back. Yo, AJ, you hear you? I can't hear you, bro. You're mute. Oh, there you go. Yeah. But uh, yeah, man, I'm about to buy this fight, man. I might watch this. I'm about to look it up right now. What time the fight come on? Like 11, 11 30. Man, I'm so irritated about this. I'm not watching no ESPN, bro. <laughs> Yo, when the next game? Hold on, let me see what the next game is. I, I gotta, I'm, I'm irritated. I ain't gonna lie, y'all. But, but Mike, Monday, Monday, Monday. But Mike, I told you this be in a regular season, bro. Your boy don't show up, bro. And you will argue with me like I'm trying to bash your team. I'm not trying to bash. I, hey, listen, Mike. I like the Sixer because of Allen Iverson, bro. He made me a Sixer fan. I like the Sixer. But I know Joe M B ain't got that killer instinct in him. He don't have it. He big ass. Why your big ass shooting threes? If you don't take that ball in the damn paint and dunk on somebody. Hey, Azo, Azo. I understand everything you're saying, bro. He pretty much dominated this game until the last, the fourth quarter, which is the most important quarter. I, I 100% agree. But it's so much deeper than just him. It's the rebounding, bro. The the one of the keys to winning, bro. They gave up. Look, fifty five to thirty three. You know what that is? Fifty five to thirty three. What do you think I'm talking you. about? What do you think I'm talking about? When I say fifty five to thirty three, what do you think I'm what, talking about? What rebounds? Rebound. We got out rebounded. Fifty five to thirty three. I feel you, Mike. But listen, how many missed points? How many missed shots did he have in the fourth quarter? He, oh, he wasn't had, good. He That's what I'm good. saying. You got man, mm -hmm. uh, all, like I ain't gonna lie, he is an all star. I'm not gonna lie. He, but a game like this in the playoff, bro, we need 40 points out of you. You know how your team is laying. You know your team ain't that good. Besides you, we need you to give us 40 points. We need 40. It. We would have had a lot more points if we were really on the damn ball. Probably so. Probably so. Because we would have had to. We would have had the ball to score. But the problem, we can't rebound the ball. So, so can like, I? Ask I don't you understand this? why. So, how would you feel? Honestly, though, how would you feel about your boy if they lose the series to the Knicks? Like, damn the injuries, man. Hey, like, hey, hey, I ain't even thinking that far, though. So. See, I, 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 I don't 
I'm not thinking that far. You know, you know, you want to know why? Because I know we're going to beat the Knicks. I no, see I'm, the Knicks. I don't. I, I'm, I see the Knicks. They don't have enough. The problem is we got a rebound. If yeah. we would have rebounded, we would have won this game by probably 13, 15 points. I'm trying to I, tell y'all. I don't think y'all going to get swept. I know y'all not going to get swept. We're going to win this next game. I don't Joel think. Be, needs to step up so. in the fourth. He got to step up in the fourth. Save your energy for the fourth, man. Tyrese Maxey has to be more aggressive. He could have had 40 points. But really, it comes down to rebounding, bro. I know. Our, our bench couldn't score nothing, bro. I don't know how many bench points we had all together. But they, at one point, they said it was seven bench points to 30-something bench points for the Knicks. So our, our bench didn't do nothing. No production from the bench. On top of no production from the bench, we're getting out-rebounding 55-33. to 33. On top of that, Joel Embiid struggling in the fourth. On top of that, we just we just didn't have a good game in the fourth quarter. But I will say this right now. We're still going to win this series. That's just my honest but look, opinion. Hey, man, I'm shocked uh, Kyle Larry ain't going crazy over there. He, did, went, he, he had a... Did he get too old? No, he got he had a good game. Man, I thought he man, shit, I thought he'd be about 25, 26. Nah, maybe he could. Shit, he he was nice because he played for the Raptors, didn't he? Man, this is crazy. Oh, uh, yeah, he played for the Raptors, played for the um played yeah, for the he, teams. He probably got he probably got old now. Nah. He had to get old. I expect more for him than 18 points in the playoffs. Hold on, what time's the what, hold on, what time is the uh fight? So I'm about to put this fight on, bro. I'm about the to fight, the fight, fight come on, though, but you know the undercard boxing right now. I ain't, oh, man. Uh, but, but they don't fight till tonight. Like Devin Haney. Yeah, man, I ain't, I, 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 I ain't get on here to talk bad about you, because I know how you feel hey. about the sisters, Mike. Hey, I ain't it, gonna it, I'm, I'm, I'm going to take all the smoke, but I'm going to say this. I'm no, not I'm watching not, no I'm ESPN. Not. I'm not watching no ESPN. <laughs> <laughs> you don't hell no, I'll do that shit when the Vikings lose. And, and you know, I'm gonna say this right now. I'm not even gonna make a video about why we lost because y'all all know why we lost. If you I don't know why, I'm not even doing it. I'm not gonna waste my time. I ain't gonna lie to you though. I know I'm why y'all lost though, for real though, Mike. It ain't the rebounds. I'm gonna tell you why though. Your boy ain't healthy though, bro. Oh, he ain't healthy. He ain't healthy, man. You know he ain't. He ain't healthy at all. Yeah, but still. But but see, he playing at about 60 for 70 percent. Yeah, I said that in that video this this morning. I said, Yo, it's the truth. Playing. Like, y'all, like, like I feel you though. It's your team, you want to win, but deep inside, you know, like man, our number one guy not even healthy, bro. He's never healthy. So we gotta just no, he's not never it. healthy. You just gotta do it. Oh, so they said, oh, so it started at 8 p.m., but they got the undercard on. Yeah, I'm, the undercard. About look, I'm about to look this shit up. Excuse my name. I'm about to look this up right now. I'm putting it. I'm looking this up right now, bro. Like, how you buy this stuff for him? You just got to go to, I'm about to figure this man, shit out. Man, Mike. Bro. I'm about to buy this. Bro, you need to get my man fire stick, bro. Know, All the fights for free. I need to get this thing going. Oh, uh, I hope Devin knocks him out, though, for real. But I'm getting off, man. I'm going to get off, Zoe. Mm -hmm. I, I don't know what to say, man. Everybody that's in the chat, if you're still in the chat, make hold on. If you're still in the chat, subscribe to my bull Zoe. He's that's my homie. He's family. So subscribe. Um, what you doing Tuesday? Tuesday, I don't even know. About 738. Because if you ain't doing shit, I'm probably gonna lie with a cat named EJ Journey. He a Viking content creator. Yeah. I, I know, I know. I'm, I'm subscribed to him. Oh, okay. If you ain't he doing cool. this shit, uh, hop on that boy with us. Yeah, all right, all right. I'm gonna, I'm gonna say what. Hold on, let me see. Let me know Monday if you could do it, cause I seen the link and shit, and I would tell him okay. tomorrow. Like my boy Michael, hop on with us. He another Viking content. If y'all, I don't know if y'all know each other, or not though. But no, I don't, I don't know. No. Oh yeah, I'm gonna give him a heads up though. If you ain't doing shit, hop on with us. All right, yeah, 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 yeah. yeah. It's on. Yeah, just let me know. Um, you said Tuesday at seven thirty Eastern time. Seven thirty. Hey, I got. Hold on, let me. I'm gonna tell you right now. Hold on, once. Give me one second. Yeah. And I, I can see in the link tonight. Oh uh, yeah. Hold on. I'm not. Let me see. Let me see. Hold on, one second, Mike. It's um. Uh, hold on, my bad, bro. Hold on. Let me see. Let me see. It's seven. Yeah, seven. It's eight o'clock. Eight o'clock Tuesday. All right. 
Yeah, I should be able to. I should be able to hop on. I'm gonna just double check because you know I got the fam. I'm gonna talk to the yeah. wife. You know, yeah, I'm gonna get. I'm gonna get with you Monday. See if you could do it. All right, it's on, bro. But I might be going back live. I'm about to watch this damn fight, man. I want to watch this fight badly, bro, because there was a lot of talk being talked. You know, Devin was talking his stuff and Ryan yeah, I'm was talking gonna, his stuff. Yeah, I'm, I'm about, about to watch my daughter up right now and go and come back home and watch that motherfucker. Could have still won if that happened. The bench has always been. Yeah, our bench sucked. Man, what T.Y. Uh, at, man? What T.Y. at? That's who I want to see. Man, he ain't even in the chat no more. That's who the man. fuck I want to see. <laughs> yeah, he was talking a lot. That was the fuck I want to see. Yeah. Yo, T.Y., where you at, T.Y.? He, 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 said, he was talking a lot. Look, he said, peace, guys. Everyone be safe. <laughs> I said, damn, T.Y., you leaving that quick? Damn. Where you from? Uh, you from Philly? I'm not even sure. Oh, okay. I don't even okay, know okay. Where, where he from. Um, yeah, but I'm going to get with you Monday, though, if you could do it or not. All right, y'all, man. A right, tough loss for the Sixers. <laughs> Rebounding bench. Not being clutch in the fourth quarter. That's pretty much what it is, bro. Like, ain't nothing to it. I'm being real. We wasn't clutch in the fourth. We couldn't rebound the ball. And the bench was trash this game. Period. So, a must-win game on Monday. Y'all bounce, bounce back Monday, bro. Y'all bounce back. Yeah, we hopefully. we Y'all at home, Monday. right? Nah, it's in New York. It starts in New York for two games. Oh, well, and then it goes to Philly for two games. I don't know about that one. Maybe game three. Game three, y'all bounce nah, back. We got to win this next game. It's a must win. Shit, y'all get two win. games at home, don't y'all? Yeah, we still got to take a game from them to win the series because it's the best out of seven. So you still got to beat them. Right, 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 we right, right. Still right. gotta beat them at home, and we could have beat them this game, but we it is what it is. It is, yeah, what it is. man. Yeah, man. But, Keep um, your head up, Mike, man. It is what it is, Keep man. Your head man. up, bro. I ain't doing no videos. Look, I'm I'm done for a while, y'all. You it's gotta like, do a video, video tonight, bro. You gotta you gotta upload a video, bro. <laughs> I ain't doing no video tonight, got bro. To. I, can, I gotta sleep on it. I'm gonna do it tomorrow, man. Do I'm it tonight. Do it tomorrow. You should do it tonight. Why it's hot? I know, man. I just don't. I don't think I got it in me right now. Man, you got it in you, bro. The dude about the five, six minute video, bro. One more spark could. Yeah, thought we had some magic this game. Yeah, man. Yeah, no. What lost is this game was the offensive rebounds, bro. Like it is what it is, bro. Like I'll be repeating my saying. I'm be repeating what I'm saying right now. Like no, what the, video. the people want it. Yeah. Yeah. Let me. Let me. I, I might. I might. But I'm gonna tell you this right now, Zoe, man. It's it this game right here was so winnable, yo. Like, like it was a domination performance in the first half, bro. And you're telling me we lose this game at the end because of freaking offensive rebounds, bro. Yeah, but the crazy part is though, bro. Like moving forward, I know it's a seven game series. You don't know how Joe and B, how healthy he gonna be Monday in them other days. Oh bro. yeah, that's a fact, bro. I didn't even think of that, bro. Like, like let's be that's real. another thing, like. How is he going to be Monday. tomorrow? How's he going to be tomorrow? He might have a swell. He might have to get an extra. I hope he's all right, man. Yeah, I'm you know what I'm saying? He, like, like, he might not be 100 He might not be 80% on Monday. You ain't lying, bro. Like, you got to think Damn. about that, too, though. Shit's crazy, bro. Yeah, man. Yo, I, you know what I'm about to do? I mean, I'm going to make this video real yeah, quick. I'm, video. Really, I'm about to talk my talk about it. But it's just like, damn, man. Really? And Josh like, Hart hit these clutch threes at the end. Like, come <laughs> on, bro. Like, what type time are we on, bro? What type time in the Sixers on right now? Yo, where Nick Nurse at? I want to talk to Nick Nurse right now. Hey, hey Mike, will y'all be able to afford Trey, Trey Young and LB on the same contract? Can you do what? Can, I'm saying, you know the dude that played for Atlanta, Trey Young. Yeah. Can y'all be able to keep him and Joe and B on the same team? I wouldn't even want him. Why? Trey Young? No. Nah, not next to Tyrese Max. You need a you need a different type of player next to Tyrese. I don't think that he needs that. Trey Young is he's not good without the ball, I don't think. And I don't want to take the ball out of Tyrese Maxey's hand. I, I wouldn't want that. I would want he's someone more than who Tyrese? Yeah. Yeah, Tyrese is nice. He I think he's better than Trey Young. This he's is better than Trey Young? I think so, yeah. Oh, he bro. had 33 points this game, bro. Hell, he had 33. Yeah, and he had a bet, and he can play a little bit of defense. Trey Young can't play no defense, bro. Oh, okay. How many Joe yeah. B had? 29. 20, 29. Shit, dude had 33. Joe B would have got y'all about 30, like 39. Y'all would have won. 
man, we would have won, man, so many factors, but Joel Embiid didn't come through at the end. I told I'm, you, I told you about him, bro. He he ain't cut like that, man. I think he, I think he is, bro. I just hope he can prove y'all wrong, man. I, I still got, I still believe that he could do it, man. I, I know you I do. He, do. He play for your team. I know. You know you what I mean, that, but I mean, we and then, and then if if he does it, then we'll see what happens after the ser series. But right now, we riding with Joel, man. You know what I mean? We're going to ride with him until the Caesar series is over or the season is over. We're going to get next game. It is what it is, man. But I'm about to get off right now. About to see what's up with us. Uh, so you said Tuesday. Let me just. At eight. Tuesday at 8. All right. Well, are we all. Is there like uh, specific topics we talking about? We're we just going in. We're just talking you know, that talk I go about. live, bro. I just go off the float. You know how <laughs> okay. I don't. Like, shit, I told you we're going to talk about, like, NFL quarterbacks, the draft, how you feel about the draft, shit, like, that. other than that, like, shit, I don't like Yeah, because yeah, I'm going uh, to keep it real, man. Like, I'm, you know, I like going for the underdog story, man. So Who underdog? I'm a, Michael Penance, in my opinion. Uh -oh. And the only reason why I say that is because, like, the injury he came, what he overcame, and then what he is, right? Like, you know what I mean? I, I just feel like people sleeping on him. If you take those injuries away, where would he be at? In your opinion, in the draft, take the injury he'd, history away. He'd be high, but my thing is, like when you when you talking about quarterbacks, bro, look at the film and look at his look at his overall production. I think Michael Pittman is a, one of the top three quarterbacks in this NFL draft. But listen though, I looked at a lot of film from like even Drake May, like. And Michael Penix, all, most of these quarterbacks, besides really, K I looked at a little bit of Caleb, but I think Caleb is out of the question. But yeah. I look at it like this. You could look at all the film. You could study all the film. You could break down all the film. But it's up to that coach to be like, yo, those flaws that that quarterback has, I could correct it. Yeah. Or I think I could correct it. Because not none of these quarterbacks that's in this draft is a perfect prospect. It's never, no, it's never there's no such thing. So the, all of them are going to have flaws. Yeah. And you can look at all the plays. You can look at play. You can look at film for two hours straight. Oh, he made that throw. He missed that throw. He's not this. He's not that. But if your quarterback coach and your head coach says, "Yo, I can coach that out of him. I can make that actually good. I can turn it around for him." Then that's that's all that matters. You know what I mean? Yeah, I've sure. seen I've seen a lot of uh, film of um Michael, and I love I love Michael. Like he probably like honestly. It's him. Is like my favorite, like one of my favorite quarters. It's Jaden Daniels up there, but I just for some reason I just don't think we're gonna get Jaden Daniels. I just I'm trying to not get my hopes up for something I don't think we're gonna do. You know what I mean? I just don't see us trading up to the top, three, like top two pick. You know what I mean? No, unless I, unless I unless too. Washington, you know what I mean? Unless Washington um picks Drake over him, then that's different. But they that might. could happen. That could happen. But like even with Drake May, like. I know people, I mean, you watch the film, Eric, right? and there's some things that I, I even watched. I've seen some passes. I'm like, dude, what are you doing? You know what I mean? But yeah. I, I still feel like it's all about the development. I feel like he has the potential. He just needs to work on a couple of things, like all of them do. You know what I mean? Yeah, my, like him, though, can you, can I don't know if you can or not. Maybe you Maybe you can give oh, me yeah. a different insight. Can you really teach a quarterback pocket present? I think so. I think you is it's it's like I look at it like this. When we gotta always remember, just like when you was talking about Bo Nix, you know how like people be hating on Bo Nix because he just throws it short and all these little these little uh short passes. I look at it like this: these college coaches are not coaching these players to be professional athletes. They're not coaching yeah. them to be uh a, a, um a professional NFL player. They're coaching them to fit their system to do what they want them to do. Right. right. So. I look at it like this. If you get a professional coach and you, there's things that there's big weaknesses, just like, I, I don't like using Patrick Mahomes as an example, but that's like the ultimate example, right? Like, mm -hmm. like I remember when they got, when they drafted him, they were trying to say all this shit, excuse my language, they tried to say all this stuff about him. Like, they tried to say he wasn't even, he wasn't worthy. Like, I remember the video, the thing you posted on Instagram when Shannon Sharp said, he pretty much, what are you doing? What are you doing, Chiefs? Yeah. Like, what are you doing? My whole thing is, look, I see the potential in Drake, man. I know some of the pocket awareness. He's he taking sacks. He throws interceptions that he shouldn't. He should probably just live the fight another day and throw the ball away. 
but I see some of the positives too. So I won't be surprised if it goes either way. If he comes to the Vikings, I guarantee he's going to do good. I think it depends on the team that these quarterbacks go to. I think that's a lot. That's the that determines a lot of the, the uh, success on these quarterbacks. Like I was saying about Patrick Mahomes, I said if you put Patrick Mahomes on another team, do you think he'll be this successful this quick? Right. I mean, you kept you know on I mean? saying that, and you're right. You but know what I mean? like, let's be for real. We all know about Andy Reid. Oh yeah, genius. But genius. KOC though, McNabb, he, McNabb. Ooh, he yeah. had McNabb looking good. Man, he had a lot of good years in Philly. Yeah, yeah. But with yeah. KOC, it's the unknown because we never seen that before. In the backup quarterback played horrible for the Vikings. So I don't know yeah. if you can develop quarterbacks or not. We are gonna see. That's the that's the big mystery, man. Like we are gonna see what happens at the end of the day, but. I, I try to not go too extreme with the quarterbacks. I feel like there's so many factors on the success. Yeah. You know what Where I mean? You like you as go. much as much as I want to say Bo Nix is not like Spencer Rattler. I'm going to use Spencer Rattler because I actually like Bo Nix. I was one of the few people that liked the Bo Nix from the very beginning. People are like, why do you like Bo Nix? Right. I, I like him. I like what I like. I looked at the film. I'm not sitting there looking at the film for hours, but I like what I've seen. And right. it's, it's up to the quarterbacks to figure that out. But even Spencer Rattler, you know what I mean? As much as I don't want us to fall out the first, the second, like, like I want us to draft our quarterback in the first round. If they mess around and they draft the best defensive tackle and the best corner that they, they can get, and then they draft Spencer Rattler in the third round or something like that, so be it. I mean, I guess I might, I wouldn't be excited about it because I don't see, I don't see the, see it, the potential like some of these other people, but I'm just saying, bro. But I don't want to keep talking about Vikings on a sixer. <laughs> Six or oh, yeah. uh thing, oh, yeah. but bad. uh bad. It's, it's all good, but um yeah, man. I just think that people gotta hold their breaks with a lot of these quarterbacks, and even like like one more thing, like CJ Stroud, like you know what I mean about the school thing, people didn't like because of the school, but I just look at just look at it's up to the coaching and it's up to what team he goes to. But then yeah. what's the bull from Carolina? The bull Drake Drake like, no, 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 no. Um that the, the <laughs> Panthers, he's on the Panthers, it's Bryce or, Young. People already call him a bust. He how came for Alabama. Call, but how do you call a quarterback a bust after one bad season? It's rookie season at that. He how? like he like gonna be a bust though. He ain't got no weapons. He looked like it, but I mean, goodness gracious! Oh no, 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 no! no I won't call him a bust right now. So, so, so if our quarterback comes in, right? Say we draft, uh, whatever. Say we draft Drake May or Jaden Daniels, and he starts week five. And he's not playing good. We're gonna call him a bust the first year. We just gonna no. call him a bust. No. I, I just don't understand like people be judging these quarterbacks. And like CJ Stroud, I'm not saying he's gonna be the best quarterback in the NFL, but I just see the potential. I, I'm yeah. like, yo, this boy is special, but he might take a step back next season. Who knows? Yeah, I got I don't CJ. think so. I got but... CJ being the, the the MVP race next year. Mm. Yeah, man. If you look Damn. at the way if you look at the way he play. Like, how can you game plan against a quarterback that really, that play in the pocket, that throw the ball short and deep, and make, make every play? throw? Yeah, like how you really every game plan? How you make game plans against that in year two? Yeah, the I AFC don't. is tough, and that's why I said it's so up in the air. Like, yo, we just got to get our guy, bro. Get all we need, and we'll we be all right. We could be like the Houston Texans. They, they, they right now is Super Bowl contenders. <laughs> In one year. <laughs> that's why, and that's why I said what I said. Like, I, I said to the bull that was on you when I hopped on your uh stream, uh, I think last week or a week or two ago, and they was like, he was like, yeah, y'all not going, y'all not going to do nothing this year. I said, okay, that's a good, that's a good point. Like, we might not, but I, I who's to say, like, I look at it like this. If we trade up in the draft, though, like, say we trade up to the second spot. I don't think that's going to happen. But say, or the third, and we give up three first round picks. You're telling me you're rather you rather start Sam Darnold week one than our rookie. I think I'm starting will. our rookie. I I'm starting our rookie. Will. You're telling me you're gonna sacrifice all that not to see your rookie start. I, I'm sorry, I can't do it. Yeah, what, what, CJ I, Stroud, I, I, like, why are everybody so scared of starting their quarterbacks? Like, why? I don't know. Why? Why why? I mean, it's it's sometimes it works, sometimes it don't. But damn, like if you giving up all this to have a quarterback, what you gonna sit him for a, almost a year to right. waste a year on his rookie deal? When the whole point of getting a quarterback in the first round is to have that fifth year option. So you wasting a year to sit him behind a guy that you definitely ain't gonna keep. You're not keeping Sam Darnold. I don't care. 
I don't right. care what they, I, feel I don't you. know. I got mixed feelings with stuff. I think I I, I don't know, man. <laughs> I, I'm I'm I don't know what they're gonna do, bro. This is gonna be crazy, man. Yeah. But oh yeah, you going live, right? I, I'm gonna try to, but I'm going to the draft though. Yeah, yeah, that's what I mean. That's what I mean. You going live on the draft? Like, can you do that? Like, you could be live I, and like show it, right? I guess I don't know. I don't know. Yeah, be careful with that. But you yeah. should be able to. I don't. I don't know if they. I don't know. That would be kind of iffy. Yeah, I that's, don't know. I'm gonna see. Shit. Fuck it. I'm gonna see what happens. Yeah, they say copyright, just take that shit down. Yeah. I mean, but I'm off, man. I'm about to get into this Devin Haney fight, man. I hope, I hope it's a good fight. I don't want it to be a knockout. I want it to be a good fight, split decision, see what happens. Right. You know what I mean? But yeah, thank, you for, man. thank you for hopping on the live, man. We're going to see what happens with the Sixers next game. And, um, yeah, that's all I got to say. Peace. Peace. All right. Have a good night, y'all. Um, we got next game. It is what it is. We lost this. We're gonna see what happens. Keep your head up. Let's go, Sixers, man. I'm out.